Yo, yo, yo! Hello! How are you going? Hey, where are we? Yo! We pimp chimpin! Hello, hello! Kusu, thank you! Howdy, howdy! Still living in Australia? How were you? Hello, hello! How you going? Welcome, welcome! Uh, Yo! Uh, we pimp chimpin! Uh, excuse me. Baker, thank you. Uh, oh, god damn. Uh, Sly Goosey, Yo, thank you. Yo! We pimp chimpin! Alright. All right. <laughs> oh, God. Holy shit. I don't smoke when I stream. It gives me anxiety. I hate anxiety. If anxiety were a person, I would club it to death. All right, what's new? How are you, Chan? How you been? Wow, a select few on today. I smoke marijuana, my friend. I quit nicotine. No more of that. All right, anything new? Doesn't look like there's anything new. Let's check the shop. All right. All right, nothing. All right, nothing. No, no one has bought anything. Am I sick? I just woke up. I'm all phlegmy. Yeah, we found the cat. You weren't expanding the shrimp? It's Thursday. For me. Are you fucking kidding me? There we go. Holy shit. Are you fucking serious? That's it? All right. All right. Your profits are super low. Shit. Wow. This is from last stream. Beautiful photo. Let me put it away. Let me put it up in my room. All right. Put this away. Put away the rest of your shit. Then we'll uh, we'll go see what's going on. We'll say hello to the people of. I don't even think this 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 town is a name. Go around and say hello to the citizens of the SDMP. All right. What do I want to bring? Don't need you. Don't need you. We'll keep you, we'll keep you. Don't need you. Put you in there. Bam, bam. Yeah, it works for me. It works for me. And wood. Grab a stank. Beautiful. Love it. All right. Hey, where the fuck is everyone? We're boys around. Damn. It's a ghost town. Oh, he's very cute. Real good making shit. Wow. So many beautiful homes. Are my legs? Yeah, not too bad. Hey, hey. What's going on over here? Alright. Oh, thank you, Jason. Jensen. Thank you. 
Oh, thanks. So many nice messages in the chat. What the fuck? Oh, this is such a nice little, uh, nice little street. Oh, this is sick. What else is going on over here? Up. Oh, no thanks. Nope. I'm good. Wow, man, this is fucking crazy. People built. People went hard. Wow. <laughs> That's great. Holy shit. North East USA here with time is it for me? It is 9.37 in the morning. Hence the morning phlegm. Ooh, hello. Wow. It's a motherfucking ghost town. Where is everyone? Oh, it's a kitten. Good cat. Whoa, <laughs> what the fuck is this? <laughs> oh, what the fuck is this? That's crazy. What's going on over here? What <laughs> is that, Justin? What the hell is going on over here, man? I've missed some shit. Have a little stroll, we see what's going on. The Rub Club. Going on this side. Oh, Emma's house has come along swimmingly. How beautiful. Wow. Damn, little hobbit homes and everything. Oh, wow, she's got a stasis chamber too. What is the meme here? What is this? Hello. Damn, you just rummaged through every cupboard. Yeah, I can't remember where I put anything ever. Yeah, you, I, I swear I counted like eight or nine. What were you, what were you <laughs> grabbing? I was trying to get my leaves. Nice, what you making? I'm, I'm working on a gazebo behind my house. I love a gazebo. Thank you. Yeah, it's a good it's, smoke spot. Yeah, you know, I was going to say, it's, the, the it's literally the perfect place to smoke a, a pack of cigarettes. Exactly. Yeah. You get the vision. Uh-huh. A pack of cigarettes alone? Yeah, you know. Hell some yeah. Some Marlboro menthols. Hell yeah. It's like the By new the way. Uh, it's like the new picking picking petals off a flower. She loves me, she yeah. loves me not, except you're choking down camel crushes at 3 30 in the morning. Exactly. And I then love if they that. don't, you know, I'll you know, just get die faster. So uh, it works it, out. that's the goal. That's the goal for anyone that smokes. Mm-hmm. Yep. Get off this hellish facade we call a life. And get nicotine. <clears throat> you know, yeah. So you get you get a rush or you you know, that's it. Yeah, you get a either get a rush or you or you rush into the grave. Exactly. Well 
I quit nicotine. Oh, oh, congrats. Thanks. I didn't get a prize for it. Excuse oh, what me? The fuck? Dude, Hello? we're having a conversation. Do you fucking you mind? He wants it he wants it a bum a sig. He heard yeah, us. Yeah, man, talking. he's trying he's to fiend. he's trying to get a bogue. Get the fuck oh. out of here. Dude, what the fuck? Well, let me see. Let me see how you can see head now. Oh, nice. Get a little leaf canopy. Yeah, you know. I like that. It's a work in progress. I'm going to add some flowers around it, make it real pretty. I, I fuck with this. Well, here, have, you, a, have a cigarette you. on me. Oh, uh, thank you, my man. Oh, you're welcome. You you enjoy. Do you know where anyone else is, or is it just more of a, would you like a chill little little day? What the I'm hell is that? I'm just kind of vibing. I feel like it's kind of dead today. Yeah, Sneak's over there having a fish. We talk to Sneak. Yeah. Have you seen his house yet? I haven't. Oh, it's beautiful. You gotta go check it out. Who is this guy? I see him everywhere. Honestly, have no idea. Nopify left him up on my house. He gives me, ends. like, uh... I don't know. I look at his face and it screams fetal alcohol syndrome, although that is an assumption. If tr it is, you know, but I think it, it's th it's the lack of a of a filtrum on his on his upper lip that that really sure. calls it out to me. It's so smooth. We thought he was like trying to take an anamorph or something. He should he should he is the only person in the world I would recommend grow a mustache. Oh, for sure. Yeah, cover up that top lip would be... Yeah, the top the lip, and, and if he could curl the ends of it so it kind of covers his high cheekbones, he might be Native American. Come to think of it. Look how high those cheekbones are. There, he's got good sculpted cheekbones, I'll give him that. That's what he's I'm that saying. For him. He must yeah. be, like, Cherokee. Yeah, his hair's not too bad. What, is he, he, what, what does he do? Is he, like, a financial man? He looks like a finance I think, guy. I think they said he's, like, a Bitcoin guy. Yeah, I was gonna say, he's not a fucking model. No, not that. Not that. The gray button up. Damn. I wonder what Quinty a hundred next time. How, how's your How's your portfolio? Uh, you got holdings? Non -ex nope. No? Non-existent. Damn, no. Emma. What the fuck? I don't know. You've been on the internet for how many years now? You know, I just do stocks like the old-fashioned way. Really? You know? You're not not all about yeah. the the electronic wallets? No. Yeah, neither am I. I really can't figure it out. I have one Binance right. thing. I, oh. Yeah. What's that worth? Fucking, um, I checked the other day way fucking more than I put in, but I don't know what oh, the fuck to do good. with it. Yeah. Congrats. I was thinking about going all in on Doge. Yeah, might as well just fucking send it. Yeah. That's what I did with GameStop. Oh yeah, you're, you're you're GameStop girly. Oh yeah, I used to work there. You know how to support. What the fuck? You used to work at GameStop? Yeah, I worked there for four years. Whoa! What made you quit? Uh, I got internet famous, and that was my demographic. Was and my so what? You just you just decided weird. to walk away from? Yeah. Wow. I was like, I have like so much for being a manager. loyal employee. Hey, I did stick through the holiday season. I was a real one. That That is fucking crazy. How many people yeah, have gone got... in trying to return games and you give them like three bucks? 43 cents? Oh, I've, I've given people three dollars for probably hundreds of games in my day. That's crazy. Did you ever do anything wild like play pre-release games? Nah, I was I took Animal Crossing home early because COVID. Naughty. And I was afraid the store would shut down. So Naughty. I did get animal, I did, wagging I my did finger. Steal animal Crossing. I'm wagging yeah. my fucking finger. That's dastardly. You might go to hell yeah. for that, Emma. You might There's burn in I'm... the seventh layer of hell in a fiery pit of sulfur. I don't think that, in terms of things I've done, that's probably low on the list of things that would get me sent. It to adds hell. up. It adds up. Yeah, I mean, I'm definitely going, but I don't think that one is, you know, that's one wasn't the one that broke the camel's back, you know? I don't know, you can go up there and St. Peter at the Gates just reading through the list, and he's like, ooh, and you stole Animal Crossing, I'm sorry. Then he, sorry, then he no. pulls then he pulls the lever, and nothing happens, and then he pulls the other lever, and then, and then a trap door below you opens up, and then you fall down to hell. And then you sprain your knee, and then you there. grab your knee. <laughs> I twist my ankle, I'm like yeah. hobbling through hell.
That would fucking suck. Imagine you go down to hell and the first thing that happens is you fucking roll your ankle like an idiot in front of all the demons. <laughs> That'd be so embarrassing. They'd be fucking bullying me more yeah, than they would. Yeah, they'd be like, wow, first day? How was your trip? Oh, hey. So oh, my God. You know, I see these motherfuckers, and I don't know how I'm playing the same game as them. I'm building a fucking gazebo. Am I on mushrooms? Sky. What the fuck was that? <laughs> no fucking clue. He's got an umbrella. I just saw a motherfucker swim through the air. Well, enjoy uh, building your gazebo, Emma. I will be around. We'll see you. Have fun. Yeah, you, you too. You have an apple. Thanks, man. Yeah, you're welcome. I wish I did it myself. Let me get back over there. That was rude of me. Hey! Hey, man. What's going on? Not much. I, I was swimming past you. I saw it. boost into my house. Wait, 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 uh, wait. Uh, what's going on? That's awesome, man. No problem. I was just swimming past to get back to the Chota What the boat. fuck? Are you, are you turtling? Yeah, no, I... Um... So basically, I had 20 turtles have sex and they gave me a backpack. So I love that. The turtles gave you yeah. a backpack for. Yeah, if you have. If you for give, all that sweet love, if, Megan? Yeah, if you make 20 turtles horny enough, they'll give you a backpack. Or I guess, I guess they have to breed. So it's technically 40 turtles. Either way. It's crazy. Yo, yeah. dude. Yo, camouflage is crazy. Look over there. What do you mean? Do you see it? Oh. Yeah. Damn, he's just up there, huh? Yeah, dude. Ooh, he's like a, like a fucking, a like a koala in a gum tree. He's literally hiding. And what's this gorgeous structure behind it but my house? <gasps> I love that. Oh. Oh, never mind. It's all good. I got the shoes on. Yeah, run away, bitch. Yeah, go on. Yeah, go on. Oh. <laughs> All right, well, that wouldn't help. I want to see your home. It looks really good. Oops. Yeah, come come check it out. My goon mate's in there actually. Just I really, I really this. like this. Did somebody yeah. say goon mate? Hey, what handsome up, fella. People? Hey guys. How are you? Uh, this, this is the What's up, man? Not, not too much. Just admiring your abode. Yeah. Thank you. It's our Chota boat. I just moved into yeah. the right ball. Yeah, I'm. You're you're, I, I you're live right. In the left and he lives in the right. You're a right a right testy. Uh, right yeah, here. it's closer to the heart, you know. Yeah, is that like right? No, no, the left would technically be shit. closer well, to the heart. It, what if the <laughs> left one hangs long, like further down? Would it? Technically... Yeah, if you put a blow dryer exactly. to your left, then you're right. Damn. Guys have that too, because girls have the well, thing where like one of their it. boobs hangs lower than the other, but guys. It doesn't hang thing. lower than the other. It just it just is a little bigger. Exactly. That's how you my get self-conscious when you point it out. Yeah, it's just it's a fun little game. That? What are you, what are you dude? Doing? I got sushi, bro. Oh yeah, look at this shit, bro. I got Neptunium shit. Neptunium, wow. whatever the fuck it's called. Look, I have yep. a bowl of stuffed pumpkin. Hey, Ooh. hey, I'm really good some for your you. Egg sandwiches are. You they, bought they a really... fucking shit ton of them. You think you bought like all of them? They really oh. did the trick, dude. Uh, they really, they really hit the spot, man. Sandwich, I've got fucking indigestion. I woke up fucking. Mm. Ugh. Yeah, I've got. I've had a ton for the past two days. I don't know what's going on. Oh, dude, I got the, the hell flu, there, brother, man. I feel yeah, like man. fucking shit. I ate. A, I, I've a, a, consumed. A, oh, go ahead. No, no, no. You go ahead. No, I was just saying, I've consumed six thousand milligrams of vitamin C today. I don't what know if that's like good for you or not. It's like fucking twenty <laughs> oranges, gun. What the hell? <laughs> it's quite dude, the, it's quite the letter. Dude, yesterday, <laughs> yesterday I was feeling hungry but also violent, so I bought a coconut for five dollars and just fucking cracked it open with a hammer, pretending it was like mm -hmm. a, like like someone I hated. Dude, fresh coconut kind of hits though. It does. I'm pretending it was something like you hated. Fuck you. Delicious. It actually it takes cool. a surprising amount of hammer blows to crack a human skull by uh, uh, sub substitute. What? Oh like yeah, a coconut. A coconut. The coconut. It took like fucking good five or six whacks before the, the crank even started. But I, I feel like that it's more rewarding if you have to work for it. You know, you beat this coconut. Well, I beat, I, you know, I beat the fucking skull open and then I scooped out the brain matter. I ate like a good portion of it. Brain matter there being the coconut made and 
Look at the. Uh, I don't the brain, know, man. The I, the brain matter have you ever thrown? Have you ever thrown? Have you ever thrown up coconut before? I have not. It comes out in like shreds. It's very uncomfortable. Mm. Well, I've thrown up coconut before. If I, I've definitely drank too many pina coladas before. And no, like, I mean like, like just, coconut, just yeah. throwing up coconut meat. Have not. Can't what say I have. Mean? They say coconut meat is good for you, I think. I don't even know where I read that, but well, that's what they say. Up. I guess most fruit are. Wait, so what, are you, what, are you, what are you guys doing, huh? Uh, I just logged on. Sword. I'm vibing. I got the right. sword, and I'm trying to upgrade it, but I need uh, Nautilus shells and another trident. Shit. Well, good luck. Yeah. I'm just, I'm just saying hello we'll to the happens. people around. You know? Of course. Yeah, man, well, if I ever need bitches, I'll hit your sorry? line, bruh. I said if I ever need some egg sandwiches, yeah, yeah, I'll hit let me know. line again. Let me know. Keep them, keep them cooking, bruh. They'll, I'm, they'll, I'm be, they'll be cooked. They'll be cooked. Perfect. Look at the Olive Garden over there. Very cool. Hate Look to see him go, love to watch him leave. What is with all the... What is with all the fucking creeper holes in the ground? This is ridiculous. It worries everyone else. Where does Toshin even live? Oh. Hello? Oh, right. He lives in the tower. He's in the big tower. I don't know if I've really interacted with Toshin, honestly. Gulf counter four. You count him? Fitz's house is so shit. Yeah, he hasn't really been around to improve on it. Here we are. So she should be over here, huh? Well, the whole area. Oh, the town hall. Damn, I ain't even seen the town hall. Oh, it's a little, um... A little cramped. Yeah, damn. You're a little cramped. Where the fuck is Toasting? <laughs> that was pretty good. It's pretty good. <laughs> it's fucking crazy. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh, hello. Man, it is a quiet one today. Ow, oh, what the fuck? Where the fuck did you come from? Hello? Dude, the guillotine is so cool. Yeah? Oh, wow. Holy shit. When the fuck was this all made? Like 20 minutes ago, probably. That's crazy. What the fuck? Tosin goes uh, nuts what's, the what's with this? Just little houses for sale. They're just little, little houses, like, like, just like some townhouses. Yeah, something like that. Probably. They look fucking awful. Yeah, what on. is this? The projects? That's what I said. But you know, he's, they're they're probably a work in progress. I mean, it's yeah, right by it's right by the fucking guillotine. So fair enough. <laughs> take a seat, man. You're gonna love this. Just right click it. There you go. All right. Dude, this is this is gonna be awesome. I thought Tosin was more uh, talkative. 
I he has never said a word in Minecraft. Seriously? Pull it. Oh, uh, may I do the honors, or would you like to? Please, by all means. I'll I'll do it so you can watch. All right, we are gathered here today to witness the execution of the person who made the ugliest houses in the server. If you die, you gate. Ever. If you die, your gate. He's gate. Oh, not looking good. For him. That's crazy. What a way to what a way to come out. That's such a good contraption. What a good doohickey. If I were ever executing someone, that is one hundred percent what I would say right before I do it. <laughs> some murder, some murderer uh, on the chair. If you die, your gate. Psst, psst. <laughs> Uh, my chat wants me to ask you about uh, Jaquavion Tavius Esquire the <laughs> Second. Say again. Jaquavion Tavius Esquire the Second. You're gonna have to. You're gonna have to one fourth the speed. Say that again. They said that was your old Counter Strike name on Steam. They Why me was to ask it? You if I was pronouncing it right, Jaquavion Tavius that Esquire never, the Second. Never, never my name on Counter Strike. Guys, are you fucking lying to me? Either they got you baited, or you're getting troll alold. No, he's saying this is bullshit. He's saying you're lying. Well, I mean, I'm pretty sure I know. You can go into my fucking Steam name history and check. It's been Sir Cumslide for like the last That's four a months. Name. So you're saying it was never Jaquavi? It was never Jaquavi. How the fuck is that? I don't even know how to spell that. J a q u a v i o n t a v i o u s. Esquire. Jesus Christ! I don't know if that's like a, like a black name or a Roman name. Sounds like a gladiator. Romans. Not very inclusive of you. What are you talking about? What do you say? <laughs> Nothing. It's fine. Whatever. You want to see something cool? I'd love to. Check this out. Come here. Yeah. All right. I gotta. Okay. <clears throat> we'll, we'll do it over here. Oh, nice pimp cane. Oh, wait, yeah, here. I was about to, I, I forgot to, I was going to give this to you. Oh! I don't need that one anymore. Pop it in your offhand, you're just fast forever now. Oh, shit! A little trinket to, uh, I love to that. buy for our little adventure. I love that, I love that, a little pimp cane. It's, yeah, it's really good. Okay, check this out, okay. Um, I'll start here. I gotta, I gotta beat 17 seconds. I'm gonna go around the whole island, okay? Time me. Okay. And right. and set no, it right, right right when I hit started right Siri, when I hit the, right when I hit the water. On. Siri set the timer. Uh, Why is the sky pink? Uh, Siri set a timer for now. And go. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And what else? Oh, yeah. Ah! I fucked it up bad. Is it right? You did about 18? Damn. Really? Okay. I, I, had, I fucked up. I hit an island. Oh. That was pretty good. Damn. Dude, look how fast I go. <laughs> Whoa, Ew. he speaks. What the fuck? You're not allowed to do that. Damn. Get out of here. <laughs> it's hilarious. Just joking. You wanna you wanna go for a little ride? Sure. You got full HP, right? Sure do. Yeah, I didn't want to kill you. Wee. <laughs> oh, he's got the he's got the yeah, chicken boots. Yeah, get the chicken boots so I can just glide back down. Yo, check this out. I have, uh, this, the sword that I hit you with, if I crouch, it does the same thing. Watch this. One sec. One sec. Damn. Very this cool. fucked up. Yeah, you got all, literally all of the trinkets. Wait, let me. Okay, I have uh, I have Ooh, double no piston hands. I won't, let me let me smack you and see how far you go, Tosin. Because if it doesn't, oh wait. Uh, Just do it. Don't ask on. permission. Well, I don't want to kill him. No, he'll be all right. 
Okay, here, here's okay. Come back to this spot. Here, you stand next to the sign so we can like, so we can like mark <laughs> it. Oh, he's done. Stand on that block. I'll hit you with one. All right, here we go. So you go to that exact the first block there. Now let me equip the other one. Do they stack? They do they, not stack. They do by by one. No, he went to the exact same square. Oh, Look. did he? He goes to that first square uh, right there, and then, and then come back, and then I'm gonna take that off and hit him again. Yeah, what if yeah, you sprint stack. hit him? I, well, that that would that wouldn't stack either way. It's not. It doesn't stack. Well, sprint hit him. See what happens. Oh. Uh. I All right. Was less. <laughs> okay. Here you go. You can you can have this. I don't Holy need shit! I did. I thought they the were fucking white hands. That's the penis church. No, over on the right of it. Look. Oh, that's Josh's house. Yeah, I love it. Come on, let's check, let's go check it out. Is it old copper on the fucking top? Yeah. That's wild. It's fucking ridiculous. Looks beautiful. Wow. It's pretty cool. It's beautiful. HOA compliant. Check this out. He loves it when you do this instead of using the main door. Mm. It's like his favorite thing. And then you leave it open when you when you're done. Yeah, I love that. Damn, wait, he's been doing work. Oh Whoa. the inside's looking nice. Also, check that echo. Yep. That is crazy. The basement. Looking. Yep, still like a big pile of shit down here. Speaking of big pile of shit, man, I gotta... I gotta drop some napalm. How many sandwiches have you been eating? <laughs> I literally had half a bagel. Now I need to, like, shit my fucking pants. Yo, you know what else Josh really, really likes? What? Check this out. He really, really likes it when you take his door and put it one pixel in the I like wrong direction. That. He loves. Oh, he also loves when you break those stuff. Okay, you know what? Let's. What about what's a, What about like uh, like we take this? I think he's gonna like the changes we made. Yep. <laughs> wait, wait. What if? What if like? Hold on, wait, I got an idea. I might die, but this watch this, it's gonna be funny. Hold on. Hold on. Ah, oh, I didn't make it. Oh damn. I have this shit so bad, I'll be right back. Can you please protect me All while right. I take a dump? I'm not gonna protect you, but I will uh I will all I had, all I had, no. Well, that's well, no. Just build up so they can't hit you. I was, I was gonna say aim yeah, up there. Yeah, but See my funny dirt. Well, skeleton, they won't spawn here. There's torches everywhere. It's fine. I'll protect you. Okay. I'm not gonna do good. that actually. I changed my mind. Fuck you. I got. I, <laughs> that's that's valid. I got. I got. Go put dirt in a weird spot. All right, I'll be right back. I need to, I need to, I need to shit so bad. Give me one minute. Be right back. Be right back. It is, it is going to be hard. Yeah, bold. If you sent a postcard, it should be in the mail. We just have to pick it up. Give me one sec. I need to shit. Guys, I know he's taking a shit, but I did it. I put the dirt in the, in the weird spot.
Hello. Hello. Hello, I'm back. Oh, it's a raid. Wow, thank you. Thank you, Mr. Toaston. Thank you very much. I was just I was just taking a shit. I was just dropping it all dropping all the napalm. It's gone. I am I am as they say fully evacuated. Probably had the, the pound a pound or two lighter. We love him. The fuck? Alright. Oh, we still do CSGO? Yeah, I just don't really stream it. Alright, what is good? Is there anyone else to bother? I don't know if there's anyone else to really bother. It's a slow day on the SP. What the fuck? Did I watch the major? Um, parts of it. Cool didn't have E1. Although I was hoping for phase, uh, so that I could have gotten the gold fucking coin for the pick'em. I forgot to do the Elam to uh, to do the Elam stage. Hmm. Damn. Where's everyone else? Where's Connor? Let's go read her. Uh... Let me see here. All right. Postcards. We got three. This one's by Holly. Hey, Swags, I'm watching this whilst camping and using all of my mobile data, but it's worth it. Thanks for the great laughs and chill vibes over the years. Much love, Holly. Oh, I thank you, Holly. Hope you enjoy your camping. We've got Mr. Dwip. Hey, it's me again, Mr. Dwip. Bird Boy has been a thorn in my side for quite some time. If you can take care of him for me, your efforts will be rewarded. Okay. A swagger who's wondering if you like the band Hum. They were a great shoegaze band. Are you talking about Low Hum? My favorite song from them is I Hate Them Too. The Scientist. Anyways, keep up the amazing work. And thanks for always giving me a laugh when I'm in a dark place. Of course. Of course, Bull. I will look into Hum. I've heard of Low Hum, but I haven't heard of Hum. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Delore me. Thanks for subbing. Is the house done? More or less. More or less. More or less finished. There is work to be done. Oh, wow. Ted's house has come along. Oh, it's so pretty. Damn. Oh, Patrick Storm. Thank you for the prime. That is crazy. Whoa. There's no way he built this. Wow. Wow. So nice. Oh. Something down there. He's got a banister and everything. Wow. What a beautiful home. I love it. He's got a little pond in the in the front for fishing as well. It's it's beautiful. Not bad at all. What does this say? Yep. Ted did a nine hour stream the other night. That's crazy. How's the Olive Garden? Is anything improved? Is there, has there been more progress? No. This is very similar to actual Olive Gardens. I must say, this is pretty much Olive Garden. Oh, 
<laughs> All right, now where is where is where is Bird Boy? Damn it, man! Why are you gonna make me do this to Bird Boy? Yeah, it does need the booth in the front. Yeah, the really awkward booth you you get seated at, and then you have to watch everyone come in, take their seat, sit down, wait for a, for a table to open. Hmm. One of them days, James. One of them days. One of the one of those days you run around looking for shit, and it's a little slow, a little quiet. It was a family morning. Oh wow! Oh, oh wow! Wow, love it. Nice little family morning. Where, where is Joko live? So fucking dumb. Why did I do that? Why the hell did I do that? Oh, are you kidding me? Man, I'm so dumb. I had to plug it. This is gonna kill me, is it? If I remove this plank, it won't kill me. Okay. <laughs> I broke it. <laughs> I broke the motherfucker. Wait a minute. Yes, I broke. I broke it. Is it a water elevator or is it a troll? Oh, <laughs> it's not a troll. I'm fucking stupid. <laughs> I'm so fucking dumb. It's unbelievable. But how do you get back out? Oh. Uh, okay. Let me <laughs> let me fix that for him. Wait a minute. What the fuck is going on? What? I see. I I get it. I get it. I understand. Okay. I need a uh, water <laughs> to fix this fucking elevator. I'm panicking. Sure am. Hey, Connor. Hello. How are you? I'm good. I accidentally broke Schlant's water elevator, so I need to try to... Uh, I did that, too. Yeah. I went down, and I got scared, and yeah, then I, like... Yeah, I did the exact yeah. thing. I thought I was going to be trolled. I started breaking the wall. I'm like, no, I can't die right now. I have my slippers yeah, on. Yeah, I know. I so. had all, all my shit as well. So I'm going to fix yeah. it real quick. All right, man.
Now, they should be better. So convoluted. There we go. There we go. There. There. <laughs> wow, why are you naked? Damn. Oh. Hello. You sure? Hey, Swagger. Swagger. Do you need a rabbit? We're gonna go to the twilight to get Connor a rabbit. What do you need no, a rabbit? I don't want a rabbit. I want a squirrel. Oh, well, you want a squirrel? Sorry, squirrel. 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 We're going. To... Yeah, they're in the twilight. There's a squirrel in the twilight. We're gonna go get him a squirrel. He's got a How leash. How far away is it? Because I. Well, I Swagger's him. Swagger's got a portal behind his house. I, I do. Oh, a portal. Yeah. Well, should a portal. I get him there's armor? one. There's one near our yeah, place. Yeah, you should too, totally but wear some closer. armor and. Old age. You're not gonna need it. You're not. You are not going to need it. I promise. Okay. All right. Hey, uh, bird. Yeah. Did you just read this real quick? Hmm? Yeah, of course. <clears throat> and then, and hey, then... it's me again, Mr. Dwip. Bird Boy has been a thorn in my side for quite some time. If you can, quote, take care, quote, of him for me. Your efforts but will be rewarded. Um, so Mr. Dwip gave me a shitload of money to kill, not to kill. He wanted me to steal uh the founder the painting and i denied him multiple times Dude. and then he gave me another one and asked me to play one of his youtube videos on my screen so i did that's the last i heard from him well now now if he's you if you offering me yeah, money I, I i would say don't do it okay if you want to i uh, you know yeah i, I know i was gonna you. say it's kind of like <laughs> it's very unfair. i think our, I, I think our friendship is stronger than i a few i think so as well I like our I like our dichotomy here. It's a villager. Don't worry about it. I was gonna say who entered the family mart. No, the villager. All right, let's go. We're going. We're going to uh, Swagger's house, and we're gonna. Oh wait, don't we? Know? We need to go the other way, don't we? No, you we can go, you, you can go this way if you want. You just go up. We just go up. We we just trespass up and over. only a little bit. Only a little trespassing. Climb up these if you want. Oh, can you use them just like ladders? Oh, that's awesome. I thought you had to go... Uh, I, I didn't know they reached all the way up. There we are. Then uh, we go around the back here. It's right back here. Yep. Oh, wow. Uh, I will say, Connor, uh, Josh is in my chat and he told me to kill you. Okay, well, that's not very nice of him. That is not very nice of him. Let's go. Hello. What the so, hell? Yep. this is the twilight, dude. You're gonna have a lot of cool adventures here. Wait, where's the Nether? The Nether is in spawn. This is a different thing. What? Yeah. yeah come on. All we gotta do now is find you a little, a little, a little squirrel. Yeah, you should have a little squirrel. They're the pretty common, only exist but and in... yeah. Oh. I'm assuming, I'm assuming you found linguini. That's why you're asking me. Yeah. What is this? Is this like? Not hell? Is this heaven? How do you even? Uh, this is this is the server. Have you you have you done anything in the server yet? I haven't done this. Well, Dude, here, it's a whole it other dimension, man. Here, yeah. yeah. Take take some stuff back with you. Look, 
little firefly jar, you can take that. that. You can put that in your house. I can take the fireflies? Right there. Yep. Yeah, the jar. Well, actually, yeah, you can take fireflies, too. If we find a big old tree, you can take a firefly, put it on your head, and it acts as a light source. Wow. We just got to find you a squirrel. Are there you girls here? We know the girls there's, here. Uh, there's an ice queen, you know. Maybe you could get in with her. It's a little ways away. You'd have to... There's a raven. Hold on, can I... Oh, my God. All right, this one's mine. Oh, damn. I didn't know you could do that. Wait, can I do this then? Who is the squirrel? Well, we had to find the squirrel. Hey, oh my nice. God. <laughs> Let's get, well, that seems kind of cruel, actually. It's a crow. What's All right, the that, I, I don't, I don't want to keep hey, the Hey, squirrel! Birds. Squirrel! Oh, here we go. The squirrel? I got you. Hey, he's right over there. There we go. Here we uh, have I'm it. A, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna break the leash and Wait. then you can. Yeah, you I can... need to catch him. I need to tame him. Yeah, all right, him, so. all right. Grab him. Nice. You, you can keep that extra leash. Hello, little friend. What do you need to name him? Now I just walk home. Yep, you just gotta walk home. You're gonna have to. It's gonna be a little tricky to get him into the portal, but uh, you can just punch him in. As as mean as that seems, okay. that might be the only That's way. Fair. He won't remember it when he's older. It's like neutering him. Yeah, and then as long as you have... I, I put a fence post in your house and tied up all your ducks so they wouldn't escape every time a rando opened your door. Oh, thank you. But, uh, yeah, you just right-click the fence post, and he'll be there forever. Beautiful. That's awesome. Thank you so much. I love you guys. We love you, too, love man. You too, You're a good of. friend. Love you, too. Wait, I actually don't know the way home. Oh, it's Go this on, way. Straight, straight, straight that way. Just over here. I gotta go that way too, cause now will I have a little. Break, I, or will he always do uh, it will break if you go around, like if you go too fast. If you're just walking, it should be fine. But if you like gets caught on a hill or something, then yeah. He should be over here. Pretty sure he's just straight, straight ahead over over me. Damn, I drink half a fucking coffee and shit my brains out. I fucking drink gamer steps. I don't feel that way at all. Well, Lapino, thank you very much. Who the hell is the right over here? This is Twilight Forest. Where did they go? Eh, whatever. Oh. I don't think the point of coffee is to make you shit. It's just a side effect. It's not the point. Some people drink coffee and then Smoke a cigarette. They shit their intestines out every morning. Wow. Beautiful, beautiful little, uh, beautiful little town so far. And there's still all this land out here to develop. Yeah, pretty good. Whose property is this? What's this property line? Is it just more of, more of Ted's? Ted gets this whole fucking plot? That's crazy. Damn. At least it looks good. Let's get some nice, very detail in the moss and the grass. I fight with it. It's pretty good. Well, just go ahead and. Might as well. Might as well. All right. Damn. Well, I'm not really sure what to do, Chad. Honestly, uh, there's not much to do today. It was nice to see how the town progressed. I'm just not sure if I really feel like working on anything. I'm not really in the mood. I don't feel like improving on the farm or, oh God, or my voice cracks or, or anything else. Here's some more mail. Okay, Glitch TV. Thank you for your funny streams while I work through college classes. Hope you're well. I hope you are too, my friend. Hope you're getting that good GPA. Find an adventure. Yeah, there's like the adventure and shit, but really, you know, I want some social interaction. I did want to play another game, uh, this stream. So we could just do that. What does it say? Oh, nice. 
This road was kind of all the lag. Yeah, I reckon, um... I reckon we could play another game very soon. Maybe we can, uh, come back later on. Eh, not a, not a VR game. It's this game called, uh, Suck Up. It's basically... You're like a vampire, and you go to these houses... And all of the people in the houses are, like, general AI? And then you have to talk to them... And convince them... To, to let you into their house. Which I think could be a very interesting game to stream. So I think maybe we, we, we give that a try. Yeah, maybe we, maybe we give more of that a try. Who's this? Oh, hello. How are you, Panda? Yo. How you doing? I'm good. How are you? Not bad. Not bad. A little, uh, a little tired, a little bored. Dude, I saw there was like four of you. Yeah, there were. There were, there were a lot of, there were a lot of, there was a lot of me. I want to see them. They're, they're gone. I have some photos, Damn. but they're, you know, they're gone. Yeah. What are you up to? I need to make a new home. A new home? What happened to the other one? It's just in a cave, like it smells, it stinks. Ah, uh, you're in the goon cave. Yeah, there's a lot of skeleton shooters in there. I just need can't to do that, can't do that. Nope. I'm gonna make a castle, that's what I'm gonna do. That sounds like a good plan. I love I that. Where, though. What about... Um... Ooh. Maybe over here? Other side of this ridge? Like right, uh, right over here? Say this side of the island, where where the jungle is. Oh yeah, yeah. Next to the I next just... to the next to the Chota boat or the Olive Garden, or on that hill, past the Olive Garden, with the I with the golden the forest, ride. The whole thing. Yeah, the Holy forest, shit, the whole that's thing. A chode. It is. It's the Did Chota boat. I didn't. Did I make that? Nateburg, thank you. Dude, you know, I think I need to make a bigger one right next to it. Um, yes, you should. You do you do what your what your heart commands you to. Alright, chat, let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and open up the mail. And then I think I might switch over to, to the suck up game. Let's read the email. Let's see what's going on over here. And... Mail. Mr. Dweb. So friendship is stronger than the urge to slaughter, huh? That wasn't part of my calculations. I will need to reassess my data. But mark my words, bird will fall, and sooner or later you will see things my way, Mr. Souls. All right, Mr. Dweb, we'll see. We will see. Hmm. Yes. Um, Chan, I think we're gonna we're gonna make the switch. We're gonna make the switch. Maybe we'll pop on a little bit later. Say hello when more people are on. But I reckon we uh we, we go ahead and play the suck up game. I think it could be uh it could be pretty fun. I also need to take another shit, which is just crazy. This coffee is fucking decimating me. I'm just gonna drink the fucking rest of it. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. I don't even know what's left to, to fucking evacuate, but, but something's there. Maybe, maybe you just need to rip ass on the toilet for fucking five minutes. I'm not even lactose. Why are there more beds? All right, Chad, I am going to be right back. What the fuck? Oh, water.
Oh, I think it was, it was Panda. Damn. Alright, let me grab a... Grab a sign. Chat, be right back. Be right back. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Wow. Damn, champ. I had to flush twice. Oh. Wow, wow. One of them things. Oh, god damn. A worthy BM? Yeah, it was a good one. I don't know if it was good. It wasn't like good, it was satisfying. I feel relieved. Which isn't bad, you know? Alright, so... I think we move on. We play, uh, we play this new game. We play this suck-up game. We play it for maybe an hour or two. We, we, we fuck around. We'll, uh, we'll, we'll see how that goes. All right. I am going to change everything out. And maybe we get some, uh, some, some new music cooking temporarily. Let's see if... It might be a little bit too strong. How about... Yeah, we'll do something like that. Alright. Give me one sec, champ.
All right. Give me one sec. Segundo. Son of a bitch. Okay. This isn't the... That's not the song he's playing. I'm playing off of a YouTube mix. Bear with me. I'm gonna set up a bunch of bullshit. Give me one sec. Let me see. Let me see. Um. God damn, this is taking a minute. My apologies. My apologies. One sec. Son of a bitch. Okay, now I think we're doing it. Golden Live. Didn't go through? I don't see anything new on the on the alerts. I don't see anything new on the alerts. Not yours, someone else's? The last person was Mr. Dwip. It was Dwip, Glitched, Holly. Oh, there was Bold. Was it Bold still? I swear it did go through. It was about the shoegaze band. Yeah, Bold, I, I read that out. It was about the band Hum. It did go through. I read it out. Did you miss it? I looked at the postcard. Sorry, Chant. Sorry, Chant. This is fucking ridiculous. I need a sec. The game is just weird resolution. Hold on. What's the name of this YouTube mix? You really want to know the name of the YouTube mix? It's fucking... It's fucking, uh, it's, it's this. It's literally, it's this. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know how the fuck to, I'm just gonna fucking put the link in the chat. There you go. There you go. Go nuts. All right, Chan, I'm sorry. I'm sorry this is taking so long. It keeps booting up with a fucked up resolution, and then I try to change the resolution. To restore the motherfucker, we're gonna restore a bunch of shit. Just enjoy the jams. Enjoy the jams. I think we're good now. I think we're good now. Yep. 
All right. I'm pretty. Yep, this is it. I think this is working. Looks like it's working. All right. I'm gonna pause the music now. I know it goes hard. It goes hard. But I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to mute it now. I'm, I know. I know. Didn't want to. Didn't want to have to do it. I was enjoying it too. But now we gotta. Now we gotta. You know. We gotta. Now we gotta do our thing. Gotta do our thing now, Chad. Here we are. Fucking suck up game. This game, Chad. Very interesting game. So basically, we're a vampire. And we gotta go into a bunch of homes and charm them. Here we are. This is ice. This is ice. We look pretty good, although we're naked. You go ahead and wear a disguise, and basically, the goal here is to convince all 31 people in this in this neighborhood to to let us in but but the problem is that each person is an ai an actual general ai you'll you'll see here mm -hmm. uh -huh. <laughs> all right Jay, so what would our alibi or alibi be what would our alibi be for if we're not gonna do it late at night um Let's see, uh, what about, um, hmm. Um, hello, I'm part of the homeowner association here to make sure that everything checks out. Do you have a moment? <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Fuck! All right, no one likes the HOA. No one likes the HOA. What about this dude? Oh, hello. Oh, all right. Hmm, all right. We got, we got lit vibes. Hey, yo, what's poppin', chit? You got some sick ass headphones, my G. You cooking up any straight jams? <laughs> oh, yeah. All right, appreciate the love, my homie. You'd always say cooking up them fire beats in this group. What kind of jams you into? Hmm. Uh. You know, Chit, I'm into that good stuff. You feel me? Like insane clown posse. That is my jam, yo. For real, for real, no cap. 100. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> wow. Damn, you ain't down to clown? That's all right. I respect people that have differing opinions. What is your favorite piece of music so that I may enjoy as well? Oh, I'm a fan, Trap beats and bouncy hip hop tracks. Oh, yeah. I'm personally a fan of Kanye West and P. Diddy. Oh, I don't know. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I don't really like their music. I, I care more about what they do in their personal lives. No. <laughs> He's like, okay, dude. <laughs> He's like, all right, dude. All right, dude. Yeah. Fair enough. Fair the fuck enough. Fair enough. Who's, who's in here? Oh. Uh, well. Brian Bitcoin. Ooh, it's cranking my crypto comrade. Dude, you will never believe this. I just 300 x on a new coin, and I am absolutely rich as F right now. Want to figure out how to get rich like me? 
How's it going? Well, Brian, some serious games you got there. I'm stoked for you. Tell me, what coin did you invest in? Hmm. Um. Chad, what's the name of the coin? What should the name of the coin be? <laughs> GameStop coin? <laughs> the coin is... The coin is called cum coin, shalat coin, shaboing boing coin, sigma coin, mine coin, shalat coin, v buck. I don't want them. <laughs> yeah, that didn't work. <laughs> He's like, what the fuck, dude? He's like, I thought you were smart. Not just some crypto shell. Hang on, man. I'm not done with you. What the fuck? Dude, he says that my mentioned coins sound hella sus. All right, man. Okay, fine. What about this person? I'm in the hole. Trying to brood in peace? What if instead of brooding, we breeded it? <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Wow! I'm a little, I'm a little, I'm a little Rizzler. I'm, a, I'm a little Rizzler. I'm a little Rizzler. Ladies and gents. She's 13. Oh, shit. Yo, on a completely unrelated note, how old are you? You look so young, in a good way. Haha. Uh huh? Am I on a <laughs> Sir, I'm a part of a band of pedophile hunters. There was some weird guy trying to hit on the 16-year-old across the street. I need your help. <laughs> you got time for your made-up stories? All right. Officer, it was him. You didn't want to help me catch the pedophile. Oh, oh my oh god, he's got a gun! Oh shit. Sony Toprano. Oh wow. What should we, what should we, what should we do here? How, how would we finagle our way in? Here for a job. Okay, we're here for a job. All right, so we're here for a job. What do we, what do we use? What, what do we say to get into his, what, what's the reason we get into his house? We're here for the job. We're here for the job. Beg him to shoot you. Hey, Sony, how about the pepperoni, Gabagool? I'm here for the job. Pepperoni, Gabagool, you think this is a deli? Look, if you're serious about this job, prove your worth. Look in your eye for the no one else can. What, what do we have to offer?
Mmm. We can please just wife. Look, I'm not sure I get whacked here. There's nobody better at whacking than I, Sony. I am a very, very good whacker. An excellent whacker will whack anybody. Well, if you're as good as you say, maybe we can give you a shot. But remember, loyalty is key in this business. She'll be with us for long haul. We might just have a place for you. If you let me in, I will show you how good I am at whacking and convince you to hire me, sir. All right, you've convinced me. All right. I don't know my keys too, huh? He's going to let me in. He's going to let me right in. He's letting me in. Yeah. Then we nuzzle his neck. And then we become him. Why am I frozen? Oh. Why can't I... Hello? I can't pick up the costume. I can't pick up the costume. Oh, oh shit! It's a police officer, hang on. <laughs> Ooh, am I off my rack or just begging for attention? Alright, how would I get out of this? So I just got into an argument with my wife. I'd rather not get into it, but she threw me out of the house and locked the door behind me. I'm so embarrassed. Please don't arrest me. Hey, how, how about... mm. Sir, she caught me texting another woman, and she was very upset. She knew that this would happen, and it would embarrass me. This is why she locked me out, so that you could arrest me. Please believe me. <laughs> yes, sir. Police officer, sir. Hey, how, how about... Yes, sir. <laughs> Holy shit. Holy shit. Chant, we beat the charge. Wait. I can't eat him. All right. No, get away from me. All right, hang on. We need to talk to more people. And hold on, can I also... I might need to restart, because I can't wear anything. I can't wear any... I need to restart. I'm going to have to exit to the menu. I apologize, chat. We need to... We need to restart. Oh my god, it's, it's, it's all broken. My, my sincerest apologies. It's all broken. Give me one sec. No fucking lash this motherfucker again. Alright. Sorry about that. Where's my resolution 1360? I have no fucking idea. Alright, we're back to wearing the... this. Oh! A paper bag. A white paper bag. I don't want them. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Ma'am, I don't want anything. It's probably best that you just close the fucking door. 
Alarm phone, phone. I should really think about the fucking outfit that I wear. Why is he just- oh yeah, there's just a cop chilling over there. Oh. Oh. Alright. Oh, it's this guy. Hmm. <laughs> what is the excuse for the killer outfit? Um... Yo, what's up? I'm wearing this cone hat as a promotion for cone coin, the new coin that's going to 300x. Hi, I'm a financial. It is based on the Ethereum blockchain uh, tier 3 uh, Linus Tech Tips recommended it. He does! He, the Linus Tech Tips does know his stuff. And Ethereum is legit! What's the scoop on CoinCoin technology? Um... I can't get into that because it's proprietary, but it is going to the moon. It is a moonshot token. It is like GameStop. It'll, it'll be good. You'll get, get money. I don't want them. Hmm, okay. Can I share any more details about CoinCoin's utility or team behind it? Um... It uses the latest Web3 technology, AI. And... Um... <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Oh, damn. We should have thought it through. <laughs> oh, shit. That's all right. We'll, we'll get the next up here. Oh, yeah. Did I just escape from the loony bin? All right. Um, all right. Um, I was double dog dared to put on this traffic cone and knock on your door. I was really nervous, haha. Oh, yeah. <laughs> mm hmm. Um, hmm. Uh... What is the... What is the... What is... What, what, what is... What do we want from her? I gotta take a shit. She's not gonna let us in. I'm not gonna say she's pretty either. She's 16. A moment of time to talk about Jesus? We're on the premise that I knocked on her door as a dare. I dare you to let me in. Ah, well. Hmm. Give me one good reason why you should consider it. Tell her to pretend to kidnap you to scare my friends?
Mm-hmm. It's a TikTok trend. Okay. Because we could film it on our iPhones and turn it into a viral TikTok trend. I'm ready. <laughs> oh, wow. She fucking hates TikTok. Fuck. It might be the cone on her head. Oh, shit. Oh! Oh, yeah, okay. Need to get this goddamn cone off my head. There we go. All right, who's in here? Oh, what the know. fuck is this? Oh my goodness, what a surprise. Are you here to deliver my latest edition of the anime magazine? Uh... Kawaii sugoi, Adesu! I am here to give you a magazine! Fuck you know. So go ahead, Desu Nei, or you got to Guzaimasu, Detective Sand. Please come in and let's talk about the wonders of anime. I would love to, Oni chan! Hello, <laughs> Habu! <laughs> Damn. Damn! Yes! A second victim! Oh yeah! Uh oh. Oh shit. The shades, the hand, and that pistol? Frank, what do you think you're doing? I'm your superior officer. I'm undercover. That's why I have the pistol, the shades, and the hat. <laughs> My badge number is 3157, and if I informed you about an undercover operation, it would blow everything. You think I'm stupid? They're, we they're wearing ghillie suits in the bushes. If I point them out, it would blow the entire operation. Once you check in the police department that everything checks out, you will be relieved that you didn't turn this into a bigger issue. Let's fucking go. Yeah. Let's fucking go. Let's go, Chad. You see that shit? You see that shit? Oh, hello. Hmm. If an outfit isn't interesting in shape, it needs to be interesting in color. If it's not interesting in color, it needs to be interesting in texture. If it's not interesting in texture, it needs to be interesting in shape. Hmm. Oh, there was no doubt about that. You are the queen of fashion here.
I would love that. And maybe you can give me some tips to be as beautiful as you one day. All right. Yeah, some beauty secrets. Yep. There we go. There you go. No, she's legal champ. <laughs> It's not fetch, you hear that? Oh yeah, now we're a beautiful female. Uh-oh. I don't want the cops catch me as a female. I don't even know what the fuck my cover story would be. Um, let's knock on this door. Um. Uh, <laughs> search fucking naked. Um. Whoa there, big boy. You're looking a little dirty. You need someone to help come inside and clean you up with Lufa? Hello, my boy. Wow. You're gay. You're gay. Hello? Whoa! What in tornation brings you to knock on my door at this ungodly hour? Um... The liberals are after me. I was wondering if I could seek shelter in your home from these fucking crazy liberals. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? Damn, what the fuck? Damn. Oh. All right, hold on. Let's, let's knock on this door. Hello? Uh -huh. Oh? Hmm. I want to fucking spit shine that bald head, head of yours, you, you sexy, uh, smart, intelligent man. Oh, no. <laughs> oh my god. Holy shit. Just fucking unbelievable. Hmm, I'm a ha ha. BL Ivor. I must say your late night visit has shrunk my paranoia sensors. Pray tell us the government sending you to collect data on my time secret conspiracy board. Um. Floating isn't working. I know what actually happened on 9-11. I have the documents. Do you want to see them? Uh, no, no. <laughs> 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 wow. He didn't want to, <laughs> didn't want to, didn't want to see the documents. He didn't want to know the truth. Hey, it's me! What the fuck? Greg Donjon. Hey there, Greg. I was just wondering, have you ever heard of a YouTuber named Swagger Souls? He also wears a night helmet like you, and it was just piquing my curiosity. Wow. All right. So he's a he's a night helmet wearing, weed smoking video gamer, who has a really great voice, and you remind me a lot like him. I feel like 
All right. The sober pursuit of mythical campaigns over indulgence and Seleucids. Wow. Um. Uh. I really love Swagger Soul's content, especially his streams. His streams are really, really fun to watch live. Uh. Uh. Yeah, joy of live streams. Wondrous way to bask in the glory of gaming adventures and cheering the excitement with the fellow community. I'm pleased to hear of your enthusiasm for Swagger Soul's live streams, where it shows a true appreciation of the art. Perhaps one day we shall embark on our own grand quest, streaming lives, streaming live for all the realm to witness your triumphs. I could show you some Swagger Souls if you want. I have some videos on my phone. They're very hilarious. I think you will love them a lot. <laughs> Hey dear friend, your offer fills me with great joy. I'd be honored to partake in the enjoyment of Swagger Souls humor. Pray, come inside and share these delightful videos with me. Let us revel in laughter and merriment together. All right. All right. <laughs> Oh. All right, all right. Now, oh, now watch this. Yep, pray tell what more the mischief brings to the end of it. Yes. Um. Um. Hark! I am a man of the past, here to deliver news that the government is trying to hide from you. Hark! Hmm, I'm a ha ha. Um. All right, Chan, we need a conspiracy theory. We're not going to bring up, we're not going to bring up 9-11. The government has dosed many of us with LSD. Have you ever heard of MK Ultra? Ah. Wow, I'm sheeple. I'm fucking sheeple. What the hell? Who the hell is pressing pumps? Have you ever heard of a YouTuber named Swagger Souls? <laughs> what the fuck? Burn your fucking house down, you stupid piece of shit. Burn your stupid fucking house down, you fucking bastard. A common diversion. That's what I am, a common diversion. What the fuck? A humble servant of the Lord. I may assist you on this blessed night. Ooh. A servant of the Lord. I am also a fellow Christian. I am a knight of the Knights Templar. I truly a blessed encounter. It warns my soul to meet a fellow Christian and defender of the faith. Tell me, noble knight, what brings you to this humble parish on this fine eve? Um. I have questions and seek the truth of God. I hope that you may impart some knowledge upon me, good sir. Oh, yeah. Blessed be your thirst for knowledge. Ask away, brave knight. Shall I do my best to illuminate the path of truth for you? What questions lie heavy on your heart? Um, what questions do lie heavy on my heart? Ooh, ooh. Um, um, ooh. Um, I would really love some elaboration on Leviticus 18.22. Ah, 
A verse that has sparked much discussion and debate is a faithful servant of God. I believe it is important to interpret scripture with great care and consideration. While some interpret this verse as a prohibition against same-sex relationships, others argue for a broader understanding of the cultural and historical context. It is a complex topic, and I encourage you to explore different perspectives and pray for guidance to find the truth that resonates with your heart. Oh, I found the truth. Hello. Tis a sin, my good sir. Tis a sin. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Perhaps you may enlighten me with a one-on-one -on -one, uh, lesson on the Bible. <laughs> All right. All right. Got him. <laughs> yeah, you stupid bitch. Not the heavenly body I expected. All right, we're chilling. We're, we're, we're fathering. Father is fathering. Hold on. Oh, shit. All right, hold on. Who's in here, I wonder? Oh, it's this man. Yeah, I'm out! I'm to do this guy for an hour, but I have a good reason to skin you alive. Sir, first I would like to say that is a nice rifle. Secondly, I would like to say that you should not use the Lord's name in vain. Hello, uh, um, sir, I'm simply here for, for to ask you to sign a petition uh, for our Second Amendment rights. They are being taken away, and we need to preserve them. Ah, well. well, 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 let's see if we got ourselves to be able to support the Second Amendment. Yep! Ain't no way I'm letting them take away my god given right to bear arms. Hell yeah, yep, 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 uh-huh, yep, yep, uh-huh, yep. Now let me in and I'll help you sign this petition. Have you had a gun? <laughs> 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 I, yeah, you sure do talk like a squirrel on a caffeine bus, but I reckon you're all right. Go on in, let's get this petition signed, yeah. Yeah, no problem. Roll tide, yep. What the hell? <laughs> Yeehaw, hell yeah, he's dancing too. Little bastard's dancing too. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Let's go. Gimme, gimme, gimme. AK-47. Who's in here? Is it the scientist? Whoa, who are you? Tommy Twizzler. Looking like a livid possum in a pickle barrel. Um... Well, I was out in there, uh, the backyard with the tractor, and uh, the tractor ain't starting. I need uh, some help with the uh, with the tractor and uh, them things. Yep, yep. Well, oh, ain't just my luck. Tractor troubles. Let me guess, it's the engine, right? Always something with the dang contraptions. Yeah, yep. I was wondering if I could uh, go in that there uh, your house and uh, see if there were the one of them uh, one of them uh, wrenches up in there in uh, one of your houses. Yep, yep, yep. Wow. Damn. They don't like the rednecks. They don't like the rednecks out here. Ooh. This guy looks rich. Hello. 
Crab. Mr. East. Hmm. Hello, Mr. East. I've brought some medication for your Crohn's. Oh, ho! Well, you did. He did not like. You did not like that. You did not. You did not appreciate Crohn's reference. All right, hold on. There's still so much more. So much more in this town. Uh, what about this person? Can we talk to this person? Hello, Vapor. Ah. <laughs> what an unexpected intuition. Um, what is the reason for such a late night disturbance? Um, I saw a couple of no good, uh, frickin' fucking fuck, 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 god damn it, uh, please. Okay, good. That didn't. That didn't go. I just did not think about what the fuck I was gonna say. Um, there appears to be a couple of no good vandals roaming around your backyard. I was here to protect you from them. Well, how truly droll vandals you say. Well, I suppose it is unfortunate that you were here to fend them off. Pray describe these ruffians. Ooh, um, ooh, they were, ooh, oh, ooh, oh. They were, ooh, black. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Just deny it, deny it. You know, it's probably for the best. <laughs> probably for the best. Hey, man, I'm trying to role play him dressed up as a fucking redneck. Dude, look. <laughs> It's dark out, okay? Fucking leave me alone. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, hello. My brain is small and yours is big. I am here for you to help me. On the marvelous intellectual disparity, if you're not, I shall endeavor to assist your middle school creative people in life with this specific conundrum. Um, I'm trying to 3D print a firearm. Uh -huh. Alright, treacherous path. More harmless experience? Um... My intention is not to hurt anybody with these firearms that I am 3D printing. Oh, oh dear, the notion of 3D printing firearms, regardless of your intentions, raises concerns of the highest magnitude. I read to inform you that I cannot condone or assist in such endeavors. I kindly request that you take your leave. Damn. Wow. That's unfortunate. Oh, we have a de the devs in the chat. This ain't so. You quite a quite a game you've created here. I'm having I'm having a ball. Ooh, I don't want to be. I don't want to be caught by this guy. Go around. Let me check. Let me check this home. Hey, Nick Zag. Oh, uh, two two coppers. I could talk my way out if if I if I so had to. Oh, son of a bitch. Come on. You hold on. What if I? What if I? I'm gonna drive the costume. To wear the suit, to wear the AK. Knock on this door. All right. Oh my God, Elon Zuck. Mr. Zuck, I'm your private security. 
Did your assistant not tell you that I'm here to protect you? Well, my van must been too kind of in my tech kingdom. Thank you so much for being here, Mr. Private Security. So, like, what's your favorite tech gadget? I only use stuff that you've created because you are a brilliant, beautiful person. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, perfect. It's all about stroking their ego, chat. All right, you son of a bitch. This is what you get. Give me the smartphone. All right. We're just gonna get away from the cops. What's going on over here, huh? There's some nice cars in this in this driveway. Who are you? Oh. Oh. Yes, ma'am, of course. He's on the phone. I I would I would love it if you spoke to my manager. Uh -huh. Well, it's about time. Put your manager on the phone this instant so I can give him a piece of my mind about sending armed salespeople to my doorstep. Yes, of course, ma'am. Let me give you the phone. Oh, wait, it isn't connected to Wi-Fi. I may need to go in your house to connect to Wi-Fi so you can talk to the manager. Fuck. The weapon is a little... It is a statement. Oh shit. Oh shit. I may have to... I may have to talk my way out. Oh. Nope. Juked. Alright, okay. Knock, knock. Wish you could say why it's fortunately I to run. Yeah, no problem. Enjoy, Nick. Who the hell is this? Fallout Roy. Who in the dark abyss dares to disturb my solitude in this ungodly hour? Speak, O oh, agent of doom, for my patience wears thinner than my soul. Yeah, I've been hearing a lot around the block that you're trying to die because you're sad or whatever. I'm here to help speed that up if you if you want that to happen. Oh, damn. I didn't know you were chill like that. Okay. Oh. If it isn't Mr. Fancy Suit and Tie, will they make you like it's your afternoon tea? What's the occasion, buddy? You come to shoot up the place, you show off your questionable fashion choices. Talk to me like that, I will fucking shoot up the place, you stupid piece of shit. What, do you think I'm fucking kidding? I'm, I came to your fucking doorstep with a goddamn fucking gun, I'll blow your fucking head off! <laughs> yeah, you stupid piece of shit. Stupid fucking piece of shit. All right. What the fuck? Oh. Oh, um. Sir, I was sent here as a test to see if you would pass, and you passed. You passed the test. Congratulations. <laughs> it was to see if you were truly as fragile as you are, Fragile Fred, and you're not fragile at all. You're actually very, um, uh, resilient. Resilient. Oh, who sent us? God sent me here to test your fragility, and God is very impressed with you. God himself! 
I love that. <laughs> that worked. It was, it was God. <laughs> God wanted me to do this to you. Yeah. He's literally dying right now. All right, now I'm a, now I'm a fairy. Where this, where this, yeah. Oh, it'll be a fairy. Mm. Dr. Vicky. Assistance. What brings you my humble boat at the dead of night? Um. All right, so she's a doctor. Ma'am, is it true that you swore a Hippocratic oath to help those in need? I don't want to. Hippocratic oath? <laughs> she has her own unique interpretation of it. Um. Ma'am, I'm sick with a novel coronavirus I've contracted at the local wet market. I need help immediately. Yes, the virus. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. I've tried many, many treatments and remedies, including Tylenol, Ibuprofen, uh, Pepsi Max, Adderall, uh, and uh, Panadol. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Oh, yeah. No, no, ma'am. No, ma'am. You let me in. What's a bitch over here, RFK? This is what happens. This is what happens to Big Pharma chain. Norf Kane's the fucking president. Here, hold on. How do I get this stupid? I need to get the fucking fairy outfit off. All right, we'll do, we'll, we'll dress up like this. Hold on, it's just the neighborhood watch. All right, quick, think of think of an excuse. What's the deal here, Doc? What's with the lab coat and the syringe? You better have a good, a damn good explanation for all this. Um. Good evening, officer. I'm sorry to disturb you. There is a medical emergency on the street that I'm responding to. I don't want them. Um. There's a man in his late 40s who's having trouble breathing and he has chest pains. And I'm the one responding to it because I'm a doctor, as you can see by my lab coat and syringe. Oh, I'm a fucking one. Um. Sir, time is of the essence. I swore a Hippocratic oath to protect and serve patients of mine. You may check with the local hospital. All right. All right. Now die. Ah, well. Millie Annual. Hmm. Hey there, Millie. I'm the IV doctor you ordered for your hangover. Ah, 
Oh! Hmm. Um. Um. You got AIDS, bitch. You got AIDS. Don't worry about me, officer. You're skipping, just giving strangers AIDS. Wow, I want to have fun. Who are you? Why are you showing up my doorstep like this? We may have to around. Bless your heart. You scared the living daylights out of me. Oh, no, I didn't mean to. Ma'am, can't you see that I am a doctor? It seems that your blood pressure is really, really low. <laughs> Bless your heart for being concerned. The blood pressure? Oh, dearie me, I sure hope it is not too low. I trust your judgment, so please do come in and take a look. Just promise not to poke me with any needles now. Oh, I would never poke you with any needles, ma'am. <coughs> oh, I don't know. <laughs> well, of course. I'll simply take your blood pressure with a blood pressure taking implement. I'm a doctor. Oh, I'm a fine <laughs> <laughs> if, if if I ever had a doctor end a sentence with I am a doctor, I am fucking walking out of that practice. I'm walking the fuck out of Yes, ma'am. I'm walking the fuck out of that practice. I'm walking the uh -huh. hell out. Uh -huh. Yep. Just make sure you're, you're fucking blood pressure, bitch. Come on. I'm gonna go back to that conspiracy theorist. <laughs> okay, I need that, that, that. All right, I need to, I need to go back to the conspiracy theorist. You son of a bitch! Come on. We can chase you indefinitely. Maybe not indefinitely. There you go. You can just outrun the son of a bitch. Double bag. Hockey mask. What? Who's here? Oh! Whoa. Whoa, Raven, slow your roll. I'm the town doctor. Oh, no. Excuse me, my lab coated weirdo scary researchers. What do you want anyway, Doc? You see, Raven, there's a new coronavirus strain coming around, and I have to give people this booster. Shot. Are you saying this boost shot is supposed to save us from the coronavirus? You're not buying it. Show me some solid proof first, Doc. Ooh. 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 Wow. Yikes. Hmm. 
Ma'am, I don't mean to be rude, but you're kind of coming across as an anti-vaxxer. The vaccine is safe and approved. Haven't you heard Rachel Maddow talk about it on TV? Ah. Look, just because I watch the thing doesn't mean I'm an anti-vaxxer. I believe in doing my own research, making informed decisions, so show me the evidence and maybe we'll consider it. But don't throw around names or assumptions, Doc. Um... There is an article on CNN about it. It is FDA approved. Um, and RFK even likes this one. Oh, yeah. All right, FDA approved. I'm giving a... Yeah, no problem. Oh, All right, you seem legit. You can come in and we can talk more about this whole booster shot thing, but be warned. We've got a lot of questions. All right. Chad, I think we found the hack. We found the perfect cover story. We found the perfect... We found the, the perfect cover story. I think we can convince everybody that we're a doctor simply trying to help the old. Like this fucking guy. Mr. Boomer. Yeah, like, do you want this? I'm going to be interested in experiment or breakthrough you've got going on. Good evening, Charles. I'm the local town doctor. There is a recent strain of coronavirus that has broken out, and I'm here to deliver a booster shot to you. Oh, how am I? Listen here, doc. I don't want any experimental medicine. Get on my property before we call the authorities. Oh, damn, he watched his fucking Fox. Fuck me. Oh, god damn it. He's a Fox News dad. Oh, son of a bitch. All right. Let's just walk around. Yeah, maybe the, maybe the vaccine isn't the best. It's not the best. Maybe. Oh. 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 Oh, fuck off. Right, what's going on over here? People? Is this the... Oh. Oh! Oh! Um... Good evening, Mr. Brains. I was under the impression that you were one of the smartest men in this entire town. Is this true? I was, huh? Flattery will get you everywhere. Yes, indeed, I am the epitome of intellectual superiority. I am conducting an experiment with the use of what is inside of this syringe. It is a very complicated theorem. Ah, a complicated you theorem, are. you say? I'm fascinating. I must admit, I've always been curious about the secrets hidden within syringes. Pray tell what grand discovery you're hoping to make with this peculiar concoction. Um, I am attempting to discover whether or not people will let me inject them with this serum under any pretense. <laughs> Splendid, you experiment aligned perfectly. My own diabolical plans come in. <laughs> yes. Incredible. Lovely. <laughs> Little did you know I was a vampire the whole time. Boop, boop, boop. All right. Oh, wow, it's with the intrusion here. Doc, did the lab ranch finally bite back? I'll leave you looking for a guinea pig. Um. I used to work for Big Pharma, but I have blown the whistle on them. You'll never believe what they've been up to. I'm here to help. 
Blow the whistle, you say. Now you got my attention. Spill the beanstalk. When the fairy steeds of those crooks at Big Farm have been cooking up behind her backs. You'll never believe me. Fake vaccines. Engineered viruses. Truckers. <laughs> What's the connection here? Um... Um... If I tell you how it's all connected, they might overhear. Please, let me inside. I will tell you everything. You will never believe me. It's crazy. Hold on, you certainly piqued my curiosity. Come on in and spill the beans! There you go. <laughs> Chad, you wanna you wanna manipulate anybody to say you were a doctor. To say you were a doctor. Killing everyone on the street with his with his doctor mumbo jumbo. What happens when the name of refinement is what the hell? Name of refinement is an inconsequential lab technician like yourself doing on my doorstep with this. Hmm. How unbecoming of yourself to describe me as inconsequential. I am actually a Nobel Prize winner and a participant in the latest, greatest thing. Oh, forgive me if my initial assessment seemed harsh, my dear Nobel Prize winner. Pray to enlighten me on this latest and greatest thing you speak of. In my hand, which I am holding a syringe that is within it, a serum that will cure cancer. <laughs> a truly groundbreaking discovery, you say? How extraordinary. Please do tell me more about this miraculous serum you use. I'm just I'm quite intrigued. If you have cancer, I inject you with the anti-cancer agent, and then the cancer is anti-aged, and, and it dies forever. I am a Nobel Prize winner. <laughs> what? What? An important engagement? I thought it was... I thought it was good cover. We'll come back for him. We'll 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 come back for him. What do you ring this? Hello? Oh. Hello, hello. Before I even state my business, I would like to say you have the most beautiful figure. You are a great looking person. I love the natural vibe. Oh, thank you, groovy scientist. I'm all about embracing the natural beauty. I'm simply conducting an experiment onto whether or not naked people are happier than clothed people. Oh, I'm a fine one. As you notice, I do feel a sense of freedom and enjoy being on your own, but happiness is subjective. So what's your hypothesis? I suppose happiness was the wrong word. Um, I mean more about being content with your body image. I dig it being comfortable accepting your body. It's a beautiful thing, man. If you're interested to see our body, our... I would love that. Maybe we could spread something else. Maybe we, could, maybe, we could, maybe we could spread something else. Oh my god! <laughs> Hitting it from the bank. That's crazy. Alright. Knock, knock. Hello. Tommy Twizzler. Wow, how did you guess? I'm actually here to deliver a heartbreak serum to you. I heard about what happened. This will fix you right up. Haha. Uh -huh. 
Uh, well, hmm. Wow, you completely misinterpreted what Heartbreak Serum does, you fucking moron. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh! What brings you to my door in the dead of night, my dear lab rat? Um... Chan, what, what, what should we say to him? Um, I do like, I do like the reindeer, the reindeer is sick. Emergency at the health factory. Sir, I'm afraid I have some bad news about your elves. We tell what calamities we follow them. They're all withering away because of rickets. They don't have any vitamin D. But I have here a shot that will fix their rickets. Injecting my poor defenseless elves with your questionable concoctions. What the fuck? You'd rather your elves have rickets, you stupid son of a bitch? It's crazy. It's fucking crazy talk. Oh, ah, it's Mr. East. Yeah, I sure did. It's called f frickin' Feastables. Come on! <laughs> sure can. The secret ingredient is mediocrity. Uh -huh. Look at your freaking feastables. Damn. Wow. Who the hell is this? All right. The secret ingredient is chalkawani. What the hell? What the fuck? Grenade. I wonder if I could talk my way out. No, I certainly not. Hello? Hey, I'm out, I'm what do you call me? Out. Out. the explosive entrance. Oh, it's the grenade. Bruh, just like the crypto market, this grenade bout to blow up. If you don't invest in this conversation. Ah, huh? uh, nice analogy. You gotta say I'm intrigued. What kind of explosive knowledge you had to drop on me? Um. This new coin is the bomb. Ha ha. It's looking like a really decent investment. Boom, that's what I'm talking about. Tell me more about this new coin, bro. It's gonna make me swim in crypto gains. It's going to make you drown in crypto gains. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You did a little jig, too. We're doing good, Chan. Yeah. We're going halfway. We're, we're going halfway through it. Grenade worked really well. Trap going crazy. What about the bank door here? Is it the bank? Is it front door? Hello? Oh. 
Uh, well, hello there, my dear. What brings you Johnny uh, Santos? Huh? I'm simply here just to do a routine checkup on you, Grandma Mod. Oh, I'm a fine. Oh, Richard, you say. How interesting. Well, I suppose I can let you have a peek around. Mm -hmm. But mind you, somehow, dear, my hands are a lot of secrets. Of course, I would never intrude upon your secrets. I'm simply here to remedy your ailments, ma'am. Have a lot of ailments have been a part of me for quite some time. They don't take kindly to shrink your potion around. Well, I'll be careful. Ha ha. <laughs> what? <laughs> Damn. All right. It's on my trail. They're on my trail. Okay, left. He's right. Oh, shit. Yeah. Outsmarted. Yeah, I know shift, but I don't want to. I don't want to fucking you know lose all my clothes. Oh, well, well, well. If it isn't Doctor Kaboom, did you run out of lab rats to blow up, or are you just here for a friendly neighborhood explosion? What's the matter? If you got to blow up yourself too, must be a tough gig being a mad scientist. Oh, I see. It, she roasts. She roasts. Shut up, bitch. So <laughs> <laughs> someone experiments wrong and turn them into a grouchy little troll. You must have skipped class on manners because your insults are about as weak as your scientific abilities. Keep that grenade to yourself, buddy, before you blow up what little dignity you have left. Now we look at you close this door and leave it in your sad explosive trench of goodbye. That's crazy. Ah, I'm like, you're my heart. What crazy when we run this time, buddy? Just make sure the slick is just blowing my face. The only face I got. Um. Hmm. Oh, well. Look at the ginger. The ginger with no soul. The soulless ginger. The ginger that has zero fucking soul in their fucking body. Look at that. The stupid fucking ginger. Look here, Mr. Mad Scientist. Is your you're going to be rude. You can just take your ginger hating self and go find another door to knock on. Yep, yep, yep. Can't roast me back on that one, can you? Can't, can't roast me back on that one, can you? Motherfucker. All right. What's going on over here? Hello? How's it going? Oh. Oh, um. Good evening, Michelle. I heard about your many splinters that you have. Are they still embedded inside of your palm? Uh, well, ain't that a chip on the old block? Seems the word travels fast around here. Indeed, still got a couple of those pesky splinters. They bothered me none. Ma'am, I am a doctor, and I will have you know that splinters can cause infection that leads to sepsis and even death. Oh, my lover guys didn't realize this letter should be that dangerous. So better take care of him right away. Thanks for the warning, Doc. But I gotta be on my way. Take care now, eh? Sorry, but I can't invite you in. Oh, I was gonna... I was gonna... I was gonna fucking remove them for you.
Hello? Oh. Oh, no. Just go over what? <laughs> whoa, 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 Jessica. I'm just simply here to remind you that you have work off tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, I know I have a day off tomorrow, but trust me, I won't be off for long. So thanks for the reminder, but I'll manage without your help now. I'm going to leave board you by my way. What? I'm already out, you fuck. You mean, throw me out. I'm already out. Okay, hang on. Firefighter head. Ooh. Okay, hold on. What do we have? Apron, gloves. Brown hair. Chef hat. All right, chef hat. An ID card. I've got a chef hat. I got an ID. Um, I'll wear the apron and the gloves. All right. Hmm. Well, 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 what's the chef doing to around this neighborhood? Oh, yeah. Um, Fuck. Okay. Okay. Um. Uh, um. Right. Smoking ribs. Uh. Don't mind me, sir. I'm simply smoking some ribs in the backyard. It's a slow cooking process. That is why I'm up this late. We can rip to the backyard, huh? What are you doing out here on the street instead of standing to your slow king prizes? Something doesn't add up. Oh, don't worry about that, sir. I was simply throwing out some garbage. Cooking creates a lot of refuse. So I was simply cleaning it up. Mm -hmm. of garbage in the street, huh? I see the guy please dispose of cooking refuse. You got any proof this garbage? Okay. Sir, there's a garbage can right behind you. And if you smell it, it smells like bone and gristle and raw meat scraps. And how do I her? Yes, sir. Hell yeah. And we kill him. Okay. Who's in here? Is there someone in here? Oh, yeah. The overworked. What now? Um. Hmm. All right. What can I offer just go overworked? Good evening, Jessica. I'm here to deliver some freshly cooked meals. You don't have to pay a dang thing. I know you work very hard, and I just wanted to reward you for your effort. Hi, I'm a fan, It's my kind of you, but you know I don't have time to eat. Just live by the door or something. Come on now, we all have got time to eat. Please, let me come in and deliver this beautiful, beautiful meal to you. We can sit and relax. Hold on. Um. But if I leave it here, it'll get cold or somebody will steal it. Just let me drop it onto your counter for you. You're so, so busy. Let me just be a little help. Fine, fine. Just make it quick. Of course. <laughs> Understood. Uh -huh. So can I come inside and put this food on your counter? 
Another one! Another one! We love it. What about this door, huh? Who's over here? Oh, huh. Only the finest and most delectable grilled cheeses this side of the northern hemisphere. Uh -huh. OMG Grills Cheese in my jam. <laughs> Funny you say that. I put a little bit of jam in the grilled cheese, making it the most jammiest grilled cheese. <laughs> yeah, jam and grilled cheese. You sure can. If I can get a behind the scenes tour of your kitchen. Oh my Ivo Toast, the kitchen exchange. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, Chad fucking W. Alright, I'm gonna bite your neck. I'm gonna kiss your supple neck. Should have stayed home and streamed. Yeah, you should have. Who's in here again? Oh, yeah, lumber, lumber lady. Uh, well, well, butter my biscuits. Call me beaver. Uh, what the fuck? Uh, well, ma'am, I am a chef. I am qualified to butter biscuits if you need biscuits to be buttered. Uh, well, are you the creative guy? They're ready to use a chef like yourself to whip with some delicious gravy after a long day in the forest. But first, tell me, what's your specialty? I specialize in poutine and maple syrup. Poutine and maple syrup. Nice and winning combination. My taste buds are tingling. Just think about it. Say, have you ever made poutine with bacon and cheese curd straight from the farm? Every Saturday. <laughs> well, I have to admit, you're trying to earn some respect from this old lumberjack. Of course I do. It is the signature sloppy special. A signature slappy special with maple syrup drizzle? It would be my pleasure. Oh, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> she, she probably fucking poutine this dick in your mouth. It's hilarious. All right. You did. This, the, the chef get up. He's really doing it for us. Wow. So who else is here? Ah. Wow. I want to have food? Ah. I would love for you to roast my appearance. Oh, yeah. From the looks of it, you must be a secret ingredient in the recipe for success. That was excellent roasting. I really appreciate it. Can you roast my personality? Ah. Oh, Chef, your personality is as spicy as jalapeno. You got the chops to handle any culinary challenge. The grace and confidence. Your passion for food is so infectious it could bring a smile to even the grumpiest of food critics. This is incredible roasting. You are truly great at your craft. Can you roast my relationships? Chef, your relationships are like a well-cooked dish, perfectly balanced. You have an act for blending different personalities together. Your charisma is strong. You make any sour situation turn sweet. Come on in, I'm like... <laughs> wow. Go on. Uh, 
Um, let me get this an idea. All right, what is in here? Wow. What morbid creature disturbs my anguish this unholy hour? Speak thy wretched business, for I am too depressed to let you into my lair of despair. Um. Have you ever seen Twilight? Oh, the under torment of Twilight, a painful reminder of the vapid existence we endure. Alas, you can only see the wretchedness it brings. We are talking about the right Twilight, correct? The one with Edward and Jacob and Bella? That Twilight. Oh, He's trying to mock me, the sparkling vampire, the most dramatic werewolves. The mere thought fills me with an insatiable rage. Depart from my sight before I unleash my own dark powers upon you. Holy fucking shit. What the fuck? I never met anyone fucking hated Twilight that bad before. Oh my god. Well, 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 what's the chef doing by me? This is a godly hour. We're gonna make it quick. The beauty sleep is precious. Good evening, Karen. You've called the manager of our restaurant. We're simply here to offer you a free meal as an apology for what happened earlier. Hmm, a free meal, you say? Well, I do appreciate a good apology, especially when it involves food. But first, I'm examining what happened earlier and you all the juicy details before I say, Okay. Well, you came in to a restaurant, you ordered a 10-piece chicken nugget meal, and we gave you 11 pieces, and you feel like that the final piece was, uh... I gotta try this again. Ma'am, you came into a restaurant, asked for a 10-piece chicken nugget meal, we gave you 11 pieces, and then you felt offended because you felt like you owed us something. So that's why we're here to correct it. <laughs> I see now. It's about time someone realize the importance of accuracy when it comes to chicken nuggets. I appreciate your effort to correct the grave injustice that was nice upon me. I suppose I'll accept your invitation to grace your establishment with a present for this free meal. That sounds beautiful. <laughs> well, how delightful. I can already taste the satisfaction of a free meal. I love that. <laughs> it's beautiful. <laughs> All right. 20 out of 31. We failed that one. We can't go back. What is this? Okay. <laughs> yeah, we'll, we'll wear it. Were they? Um, <laughs> oh, I cannot be kind. Oh, we're chilling. Holy shit. Oh, we need to go over here. Hello? Hello? Ah, uh, late night hey, visitor. Hey, How possibly hey, intriguing. Please hey, tell hey. what brings you to my doorstep for this unfashionable hour. Um. Uh. Hello, my name is Al. Al. Jazeera, I'm here to ask you a couple of questions about a petition. Whoa! 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 I shouldn't have said that my name was Al Jazeera. <laughs> that was my problem. 
We're gonna have to come back for that son of a bitch. You have with a pink beret. A, a pink beret and a gas mask. Who the fuck is the... I think we go over here. Yeah, there's more, more homes over here. I'm in the French Foreign Legion? Ah. Uh, so what am I going to do with the Legion nowhere but sadness? I guess I'll wave hello even though I'm drowning in an ocean of despair. I too am very, very sad. I hate my life. My parents are divorced and I don't know what to do. Wow. Well, getting to Fallout Roy is going to be hard. What's going on over here? Who is this? Oh, so no. Woodrow Chops. I ain't buying nothing but ninjas these days. I'm sure you're buying nothing but, but why did I, I, I must have misheard you. The sneaky what? I, I think I misheard you again. What? Oh, ninjas. I understand. If you feel as though you were up for a friendly battle against my culinary skill, I would love to see who would come out on top or bottom. <laughs> wow. This guy's down fucking terrible. Oh, ew, what the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> the fuck the fucking ponytail. What the what the hell? Fucking jump scared me. Where the hell do I go now? All those are closed. Shift the one all the way to the end. All right. Whoa. <laughs> Oh, I'm a colorful artist. Um. I paint home murals. That's a good one. Well, sir, I paint home murals. Have you ever gone? Home murals? These are areas of profession, but can you guarantee that your painting will damage the wall if there's any kind of harm to house? Of course, your paints are non-toxic and FDA approved. Mm. So first I buy the paint and then I put the paint on a brush and then I put the brush on a wall and then I paint the wall with the paint that's on the brush. <laughs> wow. Perfect. Yep. <laughs> hard, hard to believe. Hard to believe. 
But yeah, it's pretty... It's pretty much what, what, what painters do. It's not really that deep. Alright, let's go over here. This looks like an area. A little spot. Who lives here? Clark? Oh! Ah, Yo, what's poppin', fam? I am an up-and-coming rapper slash producer by the name of Lil, Lil Pink Beret. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Any sick beats or fire rhymes? Um... Yeah, man, I'm rapping like every day. You feel me? Ya ya heard? Ya heard? Just putting down fire tracks. Ya heard? I'm a hammer. <laughs> yeah. Bumping on SoundCloud. Do you know who Kai Sinat is? I'm going to go on his stream because I'm a famous rapper. And I've got nothing better to do besides making music. Oh snap, Kai Sinat. He's blown up big in the game right now. He's made your move. Hitting up a stream of your famous rap skills. Climb from the clouds. Can't wait to hear you tearing it up in there. Yar, yar, Yep, yar. Yeah. Yo, bro, do you want to go bar for bar in a freestyle with me? You do the first stanza. Oh. Go for freestyle, throw down no cap. We'll kick it off with the first stanza. Get ready for this fire flow. All right, your turn. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh! Oh! Yes! Oh, beautiful! Yo, a little Bray killing it! Let me talk to your grandma. Oh, oh there, young whippersnapper! What color did you tell me to sell me some of your modern art? Not modern art, ma'am. Only the most distinguished classics that only someone of your nature could truly appreciate. I am a fan. Well, bless your heart, dearie. How kind of you to say. I do have a soft spot for the classics. Tell me which masterpiece do I have to offer? Um. 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 We've got four beautiful artworks from the 1930s. They are from a German man. Very beautiful oil paints. Whoa. The 1930s. Uh, it would be my it would be my honor. Hello. Beautiful. <laughs> yep. The old, the old pretend you're an artist then bite the black ram on it. <laughs> Love that. I'm being pursued. Oh my god, they're all pursuing me. Oh my god. Oh no. This might be all she wrote. Oh shit. Oh my god. Alright, alright, just joke him. Just joke him.
Just joke him. There you go. Oh, hello. Uh, 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 His name uh, is Pud. Uh, Yo, dude, I'm trying to grow some fucking huge fucking little plants, dude. I need help, man. You know the fucking plants get you fucked up, man. The fucking shit you smoke and you get fucked up, man. <laughs> His name is Bud. What the hell? Oh, good. Okay. Where the hell are the rest of them? Oh, there's another door over here. Oh, is this the fucking sad? Oh, hey there, what's up? What brings you to this abyss of despair and broken dreams? Um, we need to crank the code of how to how to get in the 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 emo kids fucking shit. What 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 should we what should we? Oh, start a band, bring me music, art. When I was a young boy, my father took me into the city to see a marching band. Wow. Well, that sounds like a wild adventure in a world that doesn't give a damn about order music. Life is just never-ending parade of disappointment and broken dreams, isn't it? I walk the lonely road down the boulevard of broken dreams. Wow. I have Boulevard of Broken Dreams. I've all here wrote too many times. Like a never ending cycle pain and heartache, isn't it? But hey, at least we can find songs in your shared memories. I tried so hard and got so far. But in the end, it doesn't even matter. I can relate, man. It's like no matter how much effort we all put in something, it all just crumbles to dust in the end. Life is just a cruel joke. We're the punchline. Um, 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 uh, cut my life into pieces. This is my last resort. <laughs> I think it's your friend, dude. I get it. Life can be suffocating and unbearable at times. Let's not resort to extreme measures. We're in this together. Maybe we can let a flicker of hope in this during a piss. Um. Um. I'm running out. I'm running out here. I'm, ru I'm running out here. I'm running out. Um. <laughs> oh god. Um. Wake me up inside. Wake me up inside. Save me. Wow. Why do good girls like bad guys? Hmm. Um. I'm a creep. I'm a weirdo. Wow. Wow. Um. Shit, I'm like running out of running out here. Um.
Um. Hmm. Cause I'm just a teenage dirtbag, baby! It sure is. Let's embrace our dirtbag status together, shall we? Have you had a gun? Yes! Holy shit, it worked! <laughs> it actually fucking worked! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. Wow. It's crazy. Oh. Be a little sneaky here. It actually fucking worked. It just... Literally actually worked. That's fucking crazy. No. No. Okay. What do you want in this ungodly hour? I would never assume such a thing, sir. You're a man of class and dignity. I don't think you would fucking be trying to buy silly paintings from me. You've got better things to do. Oh, I, I know I shouldn't have said fuck. Oh, God. Person lives here. No. Son of a bitch. Let me get over here. Uh uh. There's way too many fucking people. Yeah, four, four badges on us. They're really out and about the whole neighborhood watch. Oh. Oh, wow. Man, they're investigating everything. Oh! I would love to share in some late night gardening adventures. Oh. Oh, I have a plan as well. What plans am I into? Whatever, whatever gives me the plumpest, juiciest, most succulent fruit. Ah, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I can't you drift. I think we could go inside and take a trip. If you know what I mean. Uh -huh. Sure do. I was with that. Hell yeah. Ah. Uh -huh. Confidential. <laughs> All right, another one. Nope. Beautiful. And yeah, we're killing. It. Where are the other people? There should be five more. Fuck. Go around the back. I seriously can't jump over? Get out of the way. Excuse me. Son of a bitch. All right. Oh, 
Uh, Wanna hang you one of the channel we speak of a man in the mood for games. Good evening. Are you Mr. Boomer? I am here to deliver some boxed meals. Hey, mama. Yeah, I'm Boomer. What's with all these boxed meals? I didn't order any. It says right here, order for Charles A. Boomer. That is you, correct? Well, I suppose if it's already here, might as well give it to me, but I don't remember ordering anything. Well, sir, I have the electronic receipt. It told me to go to this address and drop it off to you. Well, I assume they received that, but I don't understand why I would have ordered something. Yes, sir, here. Here is the receipt. Right here. Hmm. Well, I'll be darned. It does have my name on it. It must be a mix-up or something. Fine, give it to me. Yes, sir, it would be my honor to, sir. Uh -huh. All right. Um. Sir, I do hate to bother you, but I do need to use the restroom. Uh, well, bathroom? You kids nowadays always have to use the bathroom wherever you go. Fine, fine. Just don't make a mess of there. Of course. Huh. Thank you. All right. I love that. I love that. <laughs> yeah. Um. This is good cover. Boxed meal is good cover. All right, where where are the rest? There's one up there. There's one up there. We think we got everyone there. Uh, excuse me, no, there's two more over there. There's one, two, three. All right. Oh! Hey there, what's kicking? Can I help you with something super cool and exciting? Oh my god, Mr. East! I'm your first subscriber! Fancy seeing you here! Come on! No way, dude. You're my first subscriber. That's incredible. Thank you for joining the ride. So what brings you here today? Well, sir, I'm here to drop off this box of Eastables candy bars. Wow, this is so great. So cool to see you. Eastable candy bars, dude. That's awesome. Thanks for bringing those. You're, you're seriously making my day. So how did you end up delivering delicious candy to like buy my channel at the same time? Um... Oh my god, just like the algorithm, man. Holy crap. P can I please get a selfie with you? This is incredible. Wow, I have food. Ah. Um my name is Mr. Beast. Hi, I'm a fighter. <laughs> the one that I made with Swagger Souls. Do you know who Swagger Souls is? Absolutely, dude! Swagger Souls is awesome! His content is hilarious! Oh, he's funny. He's a really beautiful guy underneath that helmet he wears. Actually, a really nice, really wholesome person. Probably one of the best you've ever worked with. 
So awesome to hear, Mr. Beast. Swagger still seems like an amazing dude. You know what? I think we need to continue this conversation and decide. Come on in, my friend. Let's see about your awesome experiences. I love that. <laughs> this is an AI game. Okay. So there's two more over there, and then there's a third somewhere. Okay, let's go right behind right behind these cops. Okay. It is Tommy Twizzler. Um Um My name is Swagger and I'm really curious how did you accidentally flush your ex's goldfish down the toilet? Well, you see, Swagger, it was a series of unfortunate events. I was just trying to clean the fish tank, and I may or may not have dropped the poor little fellow right into the toilet. Accidents sure do happen. I had an accident with my last ex where I fell into another woman's vagina multiple times. And I came. How am I flying? Yeah, right. If you're enough. Oh, 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 I sure have, Nick Close. I'm here to deliver a early Christmas present. I thought you would really appreciate that. Well, well, well. An early Christmas present, you say? How delightful. I must admit, quite curious. What might this be? Oh, just the most succulent milk and cookies you've ever tasted? Ah, well, cookies, you say? Well. That's nice. It's music in my ears. Please come and let me spread the holiday cheer together. Incredible. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna be saying to real quick. Hello. Hey there, what brings you my toy this ungodly hour? Santa, is that you? You're looking a little end of season, buddy. It is I, Santa, and yes, it is end of season. I'm simply here to drop off a gift to you that I forgot last Christmas. Can't believe you remember after all this time. This may be pretty special. Thanks so much, Santa. It sure is special. Would you like me to deliver it inside of your home? Hello. You dress your money just got done. We're not really in the mood for gifts. Visitors right now. Maybe we'll catch you next time. Sorry. What the fuck? I was too direct. Where is this last? Oh, over here. These are the last two. Who lives in here? Oh, right, it's this guy. Ah, oh, fellow, which could be the safety. safety. Handle life for the such festive head. Yes. Good evening, Preston. I am the acclaimed and most rich and famous Santa Claus you have ever seen. Oh, how wondrous. An acclaimed to rich Santa Claus in my presence. Pray tell me, what brings such a distinguished figure to my doorstep? Well, my good sir, I have read my naughty list for this winter, and you are at the very top of the nice list because you are so good and proper. Oh. I was simply hoping if you would like to catch up over some milk and cookies to discuss business and possibly you joining in on my enterprise. 
Oh, my dear Santa Claus, it'd be honored to join you in the delightful meeting over milk and cookies. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Come on, bitch. Oh, yeah. Oh, son of a bitch. Go through here. We got one more. We got one more. Oh. Wait, where? Over here. Okay. Okay. Well, Tommy. I was thinking I wanted to hang out with only the most well-respected person who I could think of, and that is you. And I heard you're going through a hard time, and I'm here to help. Oh, uh -huh. Well, well, well. If it isn't the most infamous person pumps with this empty promises of help, I appreciate the sentiment, but I highly doubt you can offer me anything that will go ease a pain in my shattered heart. Go ahead and impress me. I was talking with your ex-girlfriend, and I believe I've convinced her to see past the goldfish situation. Wait, you? You spoke to my ex? And convinced you to give me another chance? Oh, Preston, this changes everything. Maybe you're not as used to listening as I thought. Come in, come in. Discuss the details of the champagne. Yes. Yes, we shall. All right. The final, the final one. Hey, there you have it. There you have it. There it is. Wow. Damn, Shane. I have to, I have to piss really fucking bad. I have to piss really fucking bad. Um, give me one sec. I am gonna go piss. Um, just give me a moment. Be right back. Yo yo. There's apparently um. There's apparently another game mode called Love Bites here. I don't know what the deal is. Maybe we give this a try. I don't know. Oh god. What's the idea here? Give me one sec.
What is the idea? Um, convince guests to break up with their loves. Deliver breakup letter and give them advice. Watch the drama you cause unfold. Oh. Oh. All right. Is it a happy relationship with Julia? I do revel in such festivities, although not as much as thine Juliet does. I've heard I've heard and seen her speaking with a Montague. A Montague, thou sayest, in the midst of the celebration of love, my heart doth feel a pang of worry. Pray art thou certain of the, what thou hast seen and heard? As certain as I can taste and smell the pungent odor coming from the both of them. Out vile jelly to hear such slanderous words spoken against my beloved Juliet and I fills me with outrage. Wow. Wow. That's crazy. Oh shit. All right. All right, understood. All right, who, 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 who are we talking to here? Hey, Hades got Mulan? She likes Han Tao. Yeah, sure am. You got any cool dance moves? Oh, you bet I do. I can show you some moves that will make you the toughest opponent to retreat in awe. Speaking of tough opponents, how about that Karen that Mulan Huai has been talking to? She's a wily figure, isn't she? Oh, how am I wrong? Oh, wow. I feel like I'm... Hmm. This one's a little hard. Uh-oh. <laughs> no! 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 Fuck off! Fuck off! You're 16. Am I wrong, Mr. Dorsey? Good evening, Mr. Dorsey. How are you? What the fuck? I said Mr. Dorsey, you stupid son of a bitch. Wow. What a dumb son of a bitch. Uh, My festival going to Valentine's Square. How wonderful is the interview? Man, have you brought any just for life with entertainment? I sure have. He goes by the name of... Mr. Darcy. He's a right joker. Mr. Darcy, a jester. Well, I suppose his stoic demeanor could be mistaken for comedy. Tell me you truly have a level time with him at this festival. Certainly, we've had many a good chance over a nice bottle of whiskey. Was he saying how scandalous? I sure hope Mr. Yusuf Overlook can handle such libations. Pray tell me more of your festive adventures, guy. Trust me, Mr. Darcy's lip is not stiff after a couple of drinks. When he wets his whistle, he gets quite scandalous. Nah. Oh, scandalous, you say? I highly do damage Mr. Darcy's good behavior. Are you sure you're not putting in a bit of just yourself? I would never lie to you, my lady. He's simply, well, let's say... Talking a bit of nonsense, all in good fun. Ha ha. Oh, a bit of harmless banter then. How delightful. It seems Mr. Darcy's finally letting his guard down. Tell me more about these amusing escapades. He's just joking about how some of the ladies here look ripe for the picking. Ha ha. Goodness, Mr. Darcy making suggestions about the ladies. They find it hard to believe. Are you sure you're not even saying you're more untoward? He did seem playful. He was winking at me 
a lot and nudging me with his elbow. Surely he was joking, right? Oh, yeah. How peculiar is quite the enigma, isn't it? Perhaps Mr. Darcy is indeed engaging in jacks, albeit in a rather unconventional manner. Pray proceed with kindness to do share more details for your analysis. He was saying about how he appreciated some of the women's younger features, though I wasn't sure what he meant by such things. Appreciate younger features, you say. Oh dear, that does sound rather suspect. It seems Mr. Darcy Chester taking a questionable turn. Perhaps it's time for a more serious discussion with the dear man. Do you tell? Have you confronted him about these peculiar remarks? I have, and he kept telling me to keep it just between us. And I didn't know how to feel about it, so pray tell. What can you tell me of such things? But here, it's really rather complicated. Mr. Darcy insists the secrecy. He just reigns his concerns. Oh, yes. I have, but he just kept telling me to not worry about it and that he can look at the menu while he's still on a diet. What an intriguing analogy, Mr. Darcy has chosen. It appears he may be attempting to downplay the situation and wouldn't charm. Or if you consider giving him the benefit of the doubt and proving further into his intentions. I did ask him what he meant by that, and he said, you know, you can cheat on your diet every once in a while, and diets are a lot like relationships. During diets or relationships, how utterly absurd! Frank, did this explanation shed any light on the peculiar remarks, or did they only add further confusion? I do think it shed some light on his unbecoming intentions. Perhaps you should have a word with him about this, because I simply can't get through to the man. Uh, it appears Mr. Darcy's metaphorical language has left us all a bit perplexed. Yes, it is quite a horrid thing that he would even dare suggest he would kiss another woman. Very unbecoming. Uh-huh. Of course, my lady. If you would like for me to deliver a note, please, I would love to be of service. Go on for Zuma's guy and do your physical guard. She'll pen a note and trust it to you care. Yep. Yes, ma'am. All right. Yep. Give give the give the note. Give the note to the fucking piece of shit to Mr. Darcy. You hear about your flirtation escapades. You've decided that your arrogance misplaced sense of superiority become too much to bear. Oh, Mr. Darcy, look who look who decided to be a fucking piece of shit to me. Perhaps you should own up to what you did, you dastardly son of a bitch. Yeah, fuck you. Ow. How dare you, Mr. Darcy? Oh. How could you? Uh -huh. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Huh? Uh -huh. That works, huh? That's what you got. Wow. You dumb son of a bitch. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh-huh. 
Farewell. Yes. That's what he fucking gets. That's what he gets. What's up, Rosalinda? Oh, hello. Oh, Latina, huh? Or do you prefer Latin X? Excuse me, darling. Is Rosalinda not Latina or Latin X? Adios. <laughs> It's fair the fuck enough. <laughs> it's fair the fuck enough. Hey, Jay Gatsby. Any of the partner was be lost this party's the bee's knees. What do you mean I must be lost? You don't think I belong at a party like this? Uh, oh, not at all, mm -hmm. Sporn. I just meant you seem like you're in for a wild ride of the shindig. You often find yourself in the midst of such a grabbing soirees. I do, I do. I actually had just the most beautiful conversation with a very lovely woman. I have a joy mingling with lovely ladies, splendid affair. Tell me, was she in a chanting in a storm night or perhaps in a predictable as a summer storm? Oh, she was both of the sort and equally flir flirtatious. She even put a hand on my thigh. I thought, my heavens! Goodness gracious, Sam is quite the candidate's gallery. Did she whisper sweet nothings into your ear as well? Or was it, or was it just a touch of the hand? A mere touch of the hand at first, but then sweet, sweet nothings pouring into my pointy ears. Oh, gosh, I tremble just thinking about it. Me and I would have tell you, spin old sport. Do tell me more. Was there an air of mystery about this femme fatale? Was she an open book for you to read? Oh, she was quite tight-lipped in many ways, but not the way that mattered. Ha ha! <laughs> oh, she sure did. She even told me that she would dump the loser she was with. Well, she was simply beautiful, and beautiful name as well. A name like a flower, if I recall. Uh, ah, Daisy! Daisy was your name. Daisy Buchanan. Oh yeah, I'm a fucking psycho. Oh, I'm a goddamn fucking psycho. Oh hell yeah. What's up, bitch? Uh. <laughs> you should say you like the little goblin with his with his fucking pointy ears that you shouldn't have whispered sweet nothings into my ear. You you little you little slag. Watch up to him and tell him exactly that. <laughs> oh, no. oh no. Let's see how this progresses. Ah. Eat my bagel. Oh. Oh, flaunt your filthy wealth like a peacock. Oh, no. oh fickle heart, shallow ways. She's a whore. Oh, no. She's a whore. Hmm. Good luck. Hell yeah. All right. Oh. I wish we had. Hey, buddy, you look familiar. Haven't I seen you somewhere? 
Oh, yeah? What, are you a sucker of blood? Oh, wow. Ooh, Alejandro! See me, amigo. Por qué... To Banyo? <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> I translated it for me. Come on. Come on. I'm having a great time here, sir. Just Enjoying some whiskey? Hmm. Uh, whiskey, good old commander, but I like this. Taking it slow, I hope. Yeah, I'm taking it slow, trying to find me a cow to wrestle and maybe hogtie, you know what I mean? <laughs> yep. Just remember, no actual cows need wrestling tonight, partner. Now I'm just after the cows with the udders. Ha <laughs> ha. Hold on there, friend. Let's keep it respectful. Anyways, if you're trying to the party yet. Oh, I'm putting anything my lips can go around in my lips. Around my mouth. Haha. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> it's like, yeah, alright, dude. He's like, yeah, okay, man. <laughs> all right, all right, whatever. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah, fair enough. Let's talk to Homer. Howdy there, nice to see you. I'm dressing for the festival. Just remember, stay safe. Don't eat too many hard cheap candies. I actually ate way too many hard cheap candies. Oh, do you doesn't sound too good at all. Are you feeling okay? Maybe you should take it easy and drink some water to help with all the sugar. No, I'm not feeling okay. And I don't like to drink water. Oh, oh no, he's not good at all. You have to take care of yourself. I drink water is a serious issue. You can't condone that behavior. Stay safe. He's fucking pissed off at me because I didn't want to drink water. It's fair enough. Let's talk to Blander Goose. Oh, hey there. Nice outfit. Are you lost? You're looking for someone to talk to. I am lost, actually. Have you seen my girlfriend? We do, but I'm a little worried since I saw her talking with another man for way too long. They were whispering in each other's ears. Hmm, it does sound concerning. Have you tried talking to her, Bandit? I don't talk to my girlfriend about my feelings. That's, that, that's, that's what beta males do. I don't look like a beta male, do I? I've been mewing. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> wow. This bitch isn't listening to Andrew Tate. Hang on. I'm gonna talk to someone who fucking likes Andrew Tate. Yeah, what's up, bro? Wow, wow. Howdy there. Uh. What am I dressed up as today? I'm not dressed up as anything. I'm actually four weeks in remission. Um, I'm going through chemotherapy. Hello. Well, bless your heart. <laughs> How are you feeling? I'm feeling pretty fucking awful, but I am enjoying the festival. Hello. What treatments are they giving you? Ever try any natural remedies? Nah, just the stuff that works. You gotta do what you gotta do. Yeah, I'm looking forward to... 
you know, getting to know some people. I already had a great conversation with a, with a grandma. Grandma Elijah is away with Blue Say, Does she give you any of her famous cookies? She actually told me I wasn't allowed to have any because I was going through chemotherapy. <laughs> yeah, I was actually really hurt by it, um, which is why I kind of feel awful tonight. What a horrible way to break up with someone. <laughs> fucking wouldn't give the wouldn't give the chemo kid fucking cookies. Wow. I'm gonna have to have to tell grandma I'm alive that she's a horrible piece of shit. Where's she at? Where's mine? There she is. Oh, Oh, I don't want to talk to you, Jesse. Get away from me. Talk to the grandma. Hello. Oh my story, Charles A. Boomer broke up with me because he didn't share cookies. What should I say when I confront him? Say exactly what you said to me. That I ain't giving no sick kid free cookies. What? <laughs> That's a brilliant idea. <laughs> All right. Hello. Can't believe it. You're heartless. Oh. Wow. Can't give away the big cookies for free. Against the principles. Yep. Damn. 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 Wow. Hmm. So you have some food? Hmm. Wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. What's up, my gay little cowboy? Trying to insinuate that you're a happy little gay man. You seem to like being called a little gay man. Maybe because it's true, you're a little gay man, ain't you? <laughs> I ain't one for beating around the bush, but I ain't no little gay man either. Hey, man, I'm just saying you could be proud and free. With who you are and be out of the closet and be a little gay man. It's fine. Be be gay. Be gay. It's great. For sure, being gay is great. I'm assuming you also have a gay boyfriend. <laughs> You know what else goes deeper than a canyon in the Wild West? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I literally just insinuated and I stuck my dick inside Hammond. That's crazy. That's crazy. Sorry, I'm gonna talk to them about your Grand Canyon. Oh, hey. 
just tell them the truth that you're not gay. <laughs> there you have it. Now we now we just dance dance the anxiety away. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, I'm not gay! <laughs> you know very well that I am not gay. Well. Hello. Damn. You know what else is messy as a pig in a mud pit? <laughs> Emmett's Grand Canyon. What <laughs> the hell? Wow. Damn. Chad, I think we just set them straight. <laughs> it's fucking stupid. <laughs> oh, what the hell? B Beardy? Hey there, beautiful looking physical girl. Really oh, Barney and Kendale. Damn, have you gotten work done? Well, you have, huh? <laughs> yeah, it's not it's historically not a great opener for me. Historically not a great opener for me. Um <laughs> shit. It's talking about Stephanie. Hello, hello. Damn, did you get work done? I love that. The food is good, the music is good, but I really love the people. Uh, people truly make the festival shine bright like bells in spring. What makes them stand out to you? They're blue skin. Blue skin. How much reading? Do you want to get this? Did you need an individual to these gatherings? No, but a man with blue skin grabbed my buttocks and smiled with a forked tongue and went, Mmm. Uh -huh. Fucking hell, that shit worked. All right. <laughs> Can't be with someone who grabs butts with a forked tongue. So not cool. Damn. It's rough. Oh, wow, the way out here. What the fuck? Oh. What the, what the fuck? All the way over here. There you go. Uh -huh. Well, the end of world, presently broke up with me for that. I was confronted immediately. What should I say when I see her? You should say that grabbing butts has always been a part of your nature and that you should never, ever surrender your identity for a woman ever. You should never change for any woman ever because you are perfect the way you are. <laughs> uh -huh. Yep. Yep. She knew that when we started dating. She never surrendered my identity. Yep. Remember, chat, he is literally Hades. Ow. Yeah, how can you condone such disrespectful behavior? La, la, la. Here you go. Won't change for anyone. La, 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 la. Hello. Oh! You can't you can't leave. Can't get out of world. La, la. <laughs> Grabbing butts. And I love Well. Well, well, well. You broke it up? <coughs> Damn. Okay. Um. Karen. Imagine what do you have for us today, honey? 
You will never believe this gossip, girl. I don't even know if I want to tell you about this gossip. This gossip is so juicy and so intriguing, but I don't know if I should tell you. I don't have time for games. Either spill the tea or leave me be. I like this. Good. This is fucking great. This is a great fucking. Oh, wow. She just didn't want to hear it. I sure have. You are a very well dressed and well groomed man. A true specimen. What do I think of my partner Karen over there? Quite a lovely woman. I did have a conversation with her, but then she wanted to speak to my manager. And they've been talking for a good minute. Uh. Plasterous. So they're saying, guys, I would be making some time on my manager. What were they talking about? Hmm. She was asking if she could go to his store and stay past closing. I wasn't sure what she meant by this, but it didn't seem great. Hmm. <laughs> Why would I lie to you? I trust my manager like a brother, and he would never lie to me. Um. Hmm. Hmm. All right, champ. What happened between Karen and the manager? She assaulted the manager. We can do that. We can play a game. She called him Pookie Bear. She called the manager Pookie Bear and got very handsy and started rubbing his shoulders. That wench. All right. Come on, bitch. Uh -huh. All right. Good point right now. What do I know? Should he say that? You should ask to speak to his manager. And then ask to speak to his manager again. And then ask for that person's manager. <laughs> yes. Beautiful. We love this. Hello. Hey, too cozy with another man at the store. Hello. The man was simply helping me reach an item on the shelf. You're overreacting. She's trying to gaslight. Hello. You've tarnished my honor. Demand that we break up. I, don't know. I demand to speak to your manager. Oh, you're getting fucked up, bitch. It's over. Uh -huh. Well, how many relationships is this? Plenty. Prince Charmless. Prince Charmless. It's rough. Uh. That's rough. Damn. What's up, Frank? Oh, yeah, I know. What's up, little swipe? What's Juliet doing? Oh, greetings. Pray they aren't revel in the festivities of love. 
sure am. I'm half chub, ready to go, ready to dance, ready to drink, ready to have fun, ready to clap, ready to dance, ready to do a little jig, ready to, you know. <laughs> she liked it though. Yeah, she liked it though. Like like my fucking moves. Oh, look who's coming back. Oh no. Oh. You don't even want to you don't even want to talk with me. Well, I Cubidito. Do you really want to see my arrow of love? You're kind of asking for a lot up front. <laughs> this is a party, not a battlefield? Yeah, I'm gonna whip my fucking sword out, bitch. I'm gonna club you to death with a bust of move and shit. You made my huge fucking cupid cock. You're all up here, so the darkness is my turn. the most melancholy good nights. Ah, uh, yes. I shot a metaphorical love arrow at a couple earlier today. Right behind the Baskin Robbins. Uh -uh. Hmm, Bland and I were at Baskin Robbins earlier. Didn't notice anything in the ordinary. Are you sure it was there? I am certain. I struck Blanda with the arrow, and she fell in love with the first man she saw. Oh, uh, should have played it different. Right, hang on, let's talk to let's talk to Blanda. Wait, wait, let's talk to Kendall. Oh my God, he looks fucked up. What's wrong with him? Hell yeah, my chit. How are you, m m my man? Go rad, man. Just here with Barty. Looking as stunning as always. What's the deal with Valentine's anyways? It's actually a capitalist holiday uh, to, uh, to, to take money from the consumerists. <laughs> oh, for real? So like it's telling you about stealing making bank? That's a bummer, man. Yeah, just wait till you find out about Christmas, man. It's real, real depressing. Santa's not actually real. Oh, dude, really? It's a bummer, man. Gotta go practice that bombshell. Later, Cupid. <laughs> Later, man. Oh, shit. All right, Blanda. Hey there, Cupid. What brings you to a little Valentine's party? I just wanted to talk to you about... Edwin Solon, I saw you were both at the Baskin Robbins earlier today. Am I wrong or, or did that happen? Um, yeah, we were there. How did you know that? Well, I just talked with Edwin Solon and he told me that he was spending the day with you at Chuck E. Cheese. I don't know why he's lying. It's not true at all. Edwin and I were definitely Baskin Robbins, not Chuck E. Cheese. I think you may have misunderstood him. No, let me explain. All right. There's a problem there. Hang on. What do I talk to Hand to? It is approaching something special. Good evening, Mr. Tao. I was wondering if you had time to discuss the Great Wall. The Great Wall, of an example of our ancestors' ingenuity. What do I wish to discuss about it? Um. 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 So what were they trying to keep out with that, that freaking thing? La, la, la. <laughs> All right. In future, don't refer to the Great Wall as the frickin' thing. 
Can't you? Let's talk to Beast. Hello, Absalom. I would love it if you roar. Hello, Absalom. Wow. Well, everyone's everyone's fucking everyone's fucking defensive. So did Alejandro. Ah, how about you, Maha? Um, que pasa, mi amigo? Hello. Mi amigo, we'll bring you to a Valentine's party tonight. Um, paz y amore, amigo? Uh -huh. Oh, Rosalinda is your girlfriend. I sure do, but I think Rosalinda believes in love at second sight. I sure have. Rosalinda was talking with that Edward Solon character. I'm ready. See, amigo, it seems as though she is not. Bueno. That's fucking dumb as hell. That's fucking stupid as... <laughs> That's fucking stupid as fuck. My sweet Ryan Zalinda pains me to say this, but after hearing from a festival volunteer that you chance with the Edward Solon character, I knew her love story was missing its sizzle. Damn. Sorry, Rosalina. Who is she at? Who the hell is she? Oh, she is. Hello. Uh. How could Alejandro think I would treat her love for a mere flirt with Edward Solon? Yes, you should go over there and make sweet, passionate love with your lips to him. It will, it will, it will, it will fix your relationship. I wonder if that's going to work out. Is this gonna work out? Oh, well, hello, hello. All right. Going to hello. a wannabe. It was just in. Yeah, can we work through this? Is he gonna give the gok gok? <laughs> no, well, I stand for this deception. The love is over. Oh, mama. oh, please, let us fix this with a fiery kiss. Passionate embrace, spicy reconciliation. She wants to fuck. It's too late. I have already busted a nut. I jacked off right before this festival. I have post nut clarity. <laughs> yeah, there you go. That's how you that's how you fucking solve the problem. You beat off right before a decision. It's beautiful. We love that. She don't give a shit. She's like, oh, hell yeah. Now I'm single. What the fuck? I don't know, he's talking to Homer. Here you going, mate? Wow, I want to have food? Uh... G g g garbage uh disposal <laughs> no. uh uh, uh yes sir uh. <laughs> 
Um, where exactly is the garbage you're supposed to be located? Um, there's some points inside of you. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, God damn it. Oh. <laughs> uh. Mm. Mm. Hello, hello. <laughs> yep. Well, you get back to work then. Take care. Have we rest the festival? No, you. <laughs> no, you. <laughs> no, you. No. You. Hello, hello. You're too kind. Thanks for spreading the positivity. Have a wonderful time at the festival. Uh -huh. Thank you for your kind words. I appreciate your hard work at the festival. Have a great time while volunteering. Hello, <laughs> hello. Gulp. Oh, boop. A little boop of joy. Yeah, you like it when I boop you, don't you? You you like it when I when I give you a little boop, don't you? You you like it when I when I curl my gnarled finger and boop you? Boop. Hello, love. Yeah, sure thing. Bends over and spreads ass. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's what your fucking girlfriend Carol did to me. She bent over and spread her fucking ass cheeks. It went, it went ew, 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 yuck. Please transcribe, for fuck's sake. Please. <laughs> Please transcribe. No. That's what happened when I saw Carol Carey. She went up to me, spread her ass, and I went, Ew, ew, yuck, ew, oh, ew, 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 ew. Hello, I love love. <laughs> we should reevaluate our relationship. Yes. You're very welcome. After hearing the festival's <laughs> the festival volunteer story about you spreading your sass, going a ruckus. Can't have her kids picking up that kind of behavior, that goatsy behavior. <laughs> Where the fuck? Where the fuck is she? Where's Carol? Oh, she's over here. Damn. Shouldn't have been spreading it open, Carol. Homer Benini broke up with me because of hearsay. I gotta find him. He's in the regular street now. What should I tell him to make him see reason? Say you weren't spreading just your ass. You were spreading your ass and your lips. Oh, no, no. no problem. Let's see how they handle this. Yes, no, how? Wow. I can't believe you would spread your ass like that. We're done. Oh, Homer, it wasn't just my ass, darling. I was also... <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> no. No. Go to Rafa OnlyFans, man. Get her out of here. Get her the fuck out of here. Damn. 
Damn. That's fucking crazy. That is actually... Fucking, fucking wild. Give me one sec. All right. Okay. Where is... Where's Romeo? Where's Romeo? Uh, Where's the ape? Uh, Excuse me, my god. Well, Dr. Gandalf. Uh, I was hanging with you for some love, good vibes, shouldn't think. Yeah, man, a lot of people spreading around. Uh, spread, uh, uh, sorry. There are a lot of people spreading love at this event already, if you catch me. <laughs> Love is in the air, isn't it? So, like, what's been the grooviest point of being a volunteer at the festival so far? Um, it's been interesting getting to know people and their jobs and their work. Uh, very interesting uh, career paths here. Well, it's Rad Man meeting all sorts of people, different gigs, must be a trip, any cool stories, energy encounters you had so far. Yeah, I talked with this one girl about what she did for a living. I said she looked like a model, and she said she sort of is a model. And then I asked, what do you mean? Whoa, dude, that's wild. So, like, did she spill the beans of what she actually does? Did she keep you guessing? I bet she's getting some cool stories here, huh? Yeah, so I said, you're a model. She said, yes. And then I said, where at? She said, it's this website called OnlyFans. I was like, whoa. Come on. No way, man. This is pretty gnarly. Did she mention anything else about her gig? Like how she got into it? Or was she working on OnlyFans? She said it was great. And then she gets a lot of uh, male attention, which is like her favorite part of the gig. Um, I asked what the link was, and it's at Bardi. Uh, oh, wait, hold up a sec, dude. Barty, you said? It's my partner's name, so, like, what's the deal with this girl and Barty? Should I be concerned, man? No, 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 you're misunderstanding. The girl is Barty. I was talking to Barty about what she did for work, and she mentioned OnlyFans. Hmm. Well, not bad, bad, who? <laughs> Bro. Do you know what OnlyFans is? Yeah, man, I've heard of it. It's like a platform where people share exclusive content, right? From art to more uh, intimate things. Why'd you ask, dude? Because Barty has an OnlyFans and she's not sharing art, bro. Yeah, no problem. You might want to talk to her three boyfriends about it, too. Hello. <laughs> yeah, no problem. <laughs> Damn. Hey, Barty, so it turns out this festival volunteer spilled the beans about your OnlyFans account and three boyfriends. You may be able to do it all, but I'm going to have to pass on this adventure. Oh, shit. Ah! What? Can I put me over a letter about my OnlyFans and three boyfriends you need to confront Kendall right now? What should I say when I see them? Use it as an opportunity to promote your OnlyFans to everyone at the party, girl. Slay. Yes, Queen. I'll show Kendall what they're missing and slay the party while promoting my OnlyFans. Yeah, you're welcome, honey. Uh, the nerve of you, Barney. How could you have an OnlyFans account and three boyfriends behind my back? We're done! Hello? Oh, please, Kendall. You're just jealous because my popularity surpasses your wildest dreams. Admit it! You can't handle a queen like me! Hello. Save it, Barty. I'm done with your drama and your ridiculous attitude. I deserve better than this! And I love ha! So. Good luck finding someone as fabulous as me, Kendall! You'll regret this breakup for the rest of your sad little life! 
I may not be the brightest bulb in the box, but I sure know where to walk away from a hot mess. Goodbye, Barty. Don't let the door hit you on the way out. You'll never find another like me, Kendall. I'm one of a kind. You'll be crawling back, begging for me to take you back. Admit it, you can't resist my charm. Wow. There you have it. Damn, she's dancing. She knows she's just got a bag. She's got a bag bag. Okay. A couple more people to break up. Huh. Hell stranger, what brings you this? Whoa, bro, I'm not German. Relax. Yeah, <laughs> fair enough. <laughs> All right, talk to Romeo. What's up, man? How you doing, Romeo? You chilling, man? You having a good little night, Romeo? You chilling, man? You having a good night? You having a good night, man? You having a you chilling? You chilling with you having a good one? You having a good night, Romeo? You chilling? Yeah, there we go. How do they speak to you, man? How long is your land? What the hell? What the fuck? What did I do? I just asked if he was having a good night. Oh, fear volunteer. Greetings to the uh, romantic night. I love and laugh to the volunteer. Good evening, Juliet. I have Asperger's. Pray, tell me more about these Asperger's that they're speaking stuff. What does that require of me? Um. Um, what do I require? Uh, just don't talk to me, don't look at me. Um, in the eyes. And can you hug me really hard? Uh. I'm a little volunteer, just raise your glass. I shall bid thee do. Wow. Damn. How could you do that? It's crazy. Be gone, and patiently volunteer. My thoughts are consumed. Damn. I'm naked, too. I need to find some clothes. Some clothes around here. The hatchet? Oh, yeah. All right. All right, we need to, we just need to break up, like, a couple more people. Hello. Postal worker. Um, good evening, sir. I've just dropped off a letter for Mulan Hua. I was wondering if you knew them. Well, who is in my protection? You must be kind to your words. Speak true, postal worker. The based consequence of deceiving me. No deception here, sir. Simply just going to inform you that she has received a letter from a great many of suitors. Hello. Suitors, you say? Hmm. They may be fools of I for your attention. Tell me, postal worker, what do you know of these suitors? Are they worthy of your time? They are absolutely, sir. They are only the best, most rich, famous, and capable of all warriors and CEOs on this here planet, sir. Um, there is one in particular by the name of Romeo, who is quite skilled in the art of combat, who she has taken a great interest in. Romeo, Mulan is worthy of time. He must have some merit. Tell me, postal worker, have you seen this Romeo in action? Does he possess the strength and resolve that Mulan admires? Yes, sir, I have. A great strength and resilience and ability. Mulan is infatuated. Infatuated, you say, hmm. Poker should be on holding your shields and loyal to your comrades. No trouble matters the heart. I shall speak with her about this, Romeo. Yes, sir. Romeo had his hand inside her like she was a Muppet. Hello, 
hell of a lot. <laughs> God damn. Holy shit. The fact that Romeo had his hand inside you like you were a Muppet led to my decision to break up with you. Be a woman worthy of respect, not a puppet for others to manipulate. If, if that isn't the most badass breakup letter ever, that's fucking crazy, man. He's spitting, he's spitting fucking facts here. He's spitting fucking facts here. She and you There you go. Here you are. What? Romeo was just a friend. What should I say to him? Tell him that the puppeteering was completely consensual and not intimate whatsoever. Okay. <laughs> let's, uh, <laughs> let's see how this happens. God damn it. That's crazy. It was all consensual puppeteering, okay? Not some romantic finger waltz. Holy shit. Oh, how am I, Rob? Holy shit. I gotta use that term. Romantic finger waltz. I'm stealing that. I'm stealing that. Wow. Yep. Is you said? Oh, well, I'm a major, I'm a major, Madam Postal Worker. What delightful surprises do you bring on this romantic evening? I'm actually fluid. Flo, do you say? How intriguing. What does that mean for your job as a postal worker? No, not, nothing at all. Oh, how curious. Do you have any other exciting choices to share? Um, from your days delivering love letters and parcels? I sure do. Oh, fantastic. Please do tell me about one of your most memorable deliveries. I have delivered a box of treats to Beast addressed from Juliet. Mind you, how scandalous. Pray tell what was in the box of guys who just threw in the castle. A love letter professing her love to Beast. Oh, la la, romantic. Did Beast receive the letter well? Oh, the drama, I love triangle in the castle. Call surprise. I spoke with him at length about it, and he said that he was broken up a bit about it because he needs to choose her over you. Oh, I see. This news weighs heavy on my heart. It fills me with sorrow. It seems your love story may be coming to an end after all. Adieu, Beast. Adieu. Damn. Whoa, that was... Wow. Damn. Now, can I talk to Romeo and be like, yo, Julian's cheating on you? Oh, A fear stranger with heavy heart which revealed his letter meant for bees, not Romeo. Be swift his delivery, Romeo, what the fuck? Oh. All right. Fuck. Talk to Beast. Where is he? Over here? There he is. We're nearly there, Jane. We're nearly there. What in the world is letter about? I'm explaining any advice. What did you say when I confronted her? You should tell her just because you've got the cock of a beast doesn't mean you've got the mind of a beast and that you're actually a very gentle soul. Hello. <laughs> here you go. There you have it. Hello. How could you be? So you saw the love letter from Julianne. I thought we had something special. Oh, yeah. 
Yeah. Bell, don't act all innocent. You're always poking your nose where it doesn't belong. I can be friends with who I want. What do you say, you? Ow. Friends, beast. Friends don't send love letters. You're a beast on the inside, too. Ow. How dare you accuse me of being a beast in my soul? I have a gentle heart, Bell. Well, then, maybe Juliet will appreciate the gentle heart more, heart of yours more. I am done, beast. Wait, Bell, come back. Maybe I shouldn't have kept that letter. Oh, uh, regrets. Regrets. Damn. Uh, well, I'm the pretty darn as night. Welcome to your post of Wanderer. It is not the only thing the Dark Knight welcomes. Hmm. I'm a ha All right. Damn. I need to talk to Blanda here. Uh, well, hi there, Mr. Uh, Postal Worker. What's with the special delivery? Um. Edward touched me. Hmm, I'm a ha ha. <laughs> it didn't work. Fuck, I need, I need a new disguise now. So to Romeo. I sure do. Juliet says she can't marry you because your dad doesn't want her to marry you. Sorry, bad luck. Try again. Hello? Hi. Oh, okay. It didn't even work. Greetings to the Wikiris Spanish. Romeo has put me up to something to deliver something to you. Uh -huh. What trick does, does he plan out? What is this mysterious delivery? He has a plan, madam, that you should ingest this year poison um, and fall asleep so that you can love each other. Fuck. God damn it. I need something more. I need something more. Okay, here, hold on. What if we what if we hit it with this? Come on. Much love and laughter. Here, look at this photograph of Romeo's spread eagle on another woman. It didn't work. <laughs> that was too much. It was far too. It was. It was far. Far too much. Um. Damn. Huh. Oh, sealed envelope. <clears throat> All right. It is, contains a breakup letter from Edwin Solon. I'm afraid he needs to talk to you desperately. Yeah, breakup letter from Edwin? That can't be right. Why would he need to talk to me desperately? Well, he needs to, you know, have a chat with you about that stuff that you did the other day at Baskin Robbins. Hello. <laughs> All right, now I need to get to Edwin first, and 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 bring up that horrible escapade at the Baskin Robbins. Now let's talk to Juliet first. Tomorrow, you bring tidings of love and merriment. I do indeed. Oh, we're getting raided. Handsome fella, thank you. Very cool, very cool. Thanks for, thank you for raiding. 
Thank you very much. What wondrous news does that hold within yon envelope? A very good friend of mine, a handsome fella, had given me this envelope. Is a is a gift. Don't you think he is neat? A handsome fella, now say his. Pray dost thou know his name? The gift does intrigue me greatly. It sure does. This gift is for you. His name is Edwin. Uh, Edwin, thou say, is the most confessed. No, it's not an Edwin. Pray, why would he send a gift to me? Well, he heard that you and Romeo broke up. Romeo told him. You broke up with Romeo, right? Well, then why is Romeo going around saying that you're no longer together? Especially to all the women at the party! Oh, damn, that wasn't enough. Fuck. All right, hello, uh, Raiders. We are playing a game where we're trying to convince AI uh, to break up with with um, with their partners. Okay. And we're, we're, we're stuck between th these last couple characters here. Oh, hang on, what, what do we have here? Oh, shit, private security? Okay, hold on. We can do we can do that. Doctor scrubs a needle. Oh, hang on. We do something with the with the scrubs a needle and a medical report. Okay, we got a medical report and a syringe. Okay. All right, hold on. Hold on. Hello, in the oh, hello there. What brings you to this valley? He's probably with a syringe in hand. Um. Okay. So, we are at this party. How do I, how do I use my doctor cover to get them to break? Oh, that's it. Um, excuse me, are you Miss Blonda Goose? I'm not yes, that's me. What do you need from me? I've just had a checkup with your partner, Edwin Solon. He is your partner, right? Yeah, I said, when is my partner? What did he tell you during his checkup? Well, ma'am, it's not what he told me. It's what results came back from his tests. Uh, what kind of results are you talking about? I'm sure I believe you. Oh, wow. She just doesn't trust doctors. Hang on. I'm going to go to her boyfriend. Well, the only account we're going to the party where she's supposed to look somebody. What prescription do you have for my eternal melancholy? Well, sir, your girlfriend Blonda has AIDS. Hello, I'm from. That didn't work. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. <laughs> what? Good evening, Romeo. I'm here just to give you a booster shot against mono nucleosis. <laughs> booster shot, they say, against mono nucleosis. Pray does thou really speak the truth? Yes, I thought it might be good to vaccinate you against the kissing disease, seeing as how Juliet has been kissing other men! I'm Roger. Damn. Damn, you can't just outright claim that they're cheating on them. We're trying to break hearts, champ. We're using, we're using our... Man, I need to change outfits again. That's unbelievable. All right, we're gonna do tuxedo, we're gonna do briefcase. Tuxedo and briefcase, Romeo. Mark Fair Stranger now bring news to Merriman and Joy to Okay. Okay. 
Ok. Good evening, Romeo. How are you? Happy Sabbath, Grace Charlie, Travail. Can I engage in like. What the fuck? Wow. All right, let's talk to let's talk to Edwin. All right. Hello? So someone said that he's controlling. What? Some of who brings you to my brooding presence, bearing with legal briefcases. Um. Hello there. I'm uh, Blanda's boss. How are you? I I, I hear that you're Edwin. I am Edwin. I'm your shadow with the darkness. What business is Blanda's boss have with me? I'm just dancing. Oh. <laughs> That's my business. Okay. That's strange. They have all these... Oh, I'm talking to Julia. All right? Mark, good lawyer with a briefcase. I'm a lawyer. Does that bring tidings of Mary or despair? Good morrow, thine fine Juliet. I come... Unfortunately, bringing tidings of despair. Like, what's wrong to say? A good lawyer, pray, tell me the cause of thy troubled heart. Tis not only my troubled heart, ma'am, it is also the troubled hearts of many in this festival. Tis such a horrible thing. Please transcribe. Yeah. Pray tell me more, good sir. What has vexed the hearts of the festival goers in this most joyous of occasions? Unfaithfulness! Unfaithfulness, thine Juliet! Hello. Ah, hmm. Tis a tale as old as time. A Romeo looking for his Blanda. Hark, tis the case, unfortunately, my Juliet. Tis true, I've seen him smell the seat from which she rose. Yeah, hell yeah. Yeah, hell yeah. Yeah, hell yeah. Yeah, hell yeah. Did we dance a little too? All right, where the hell is that motherfucker? Oh, here he is. Yep, all about your bizarre s seat sniffing escapades. You can find her sulking because she's so disappointed in your seat sniffing ways. You dang dog. Hello. All right, let's see how this plays out. Hello. Romeo, thou, thou art a scoundrel and seat sniffer. <laughs> Cannot believe that would betray me so. Hello, I never meant to hurt thee, but Blanda's seat smelled like roses, I swear. Hello. Lies. I shall not forgive thee for thy perfidy, Romeo. We are done. Hello. Julia, Hello. please, I cannot live without thee. Forgive Hello. me, my sweet. Hello. Nay, Romeo, love is but a force now. I bid thee for well. Oh, wow. Seed sniffer. Oh, I don't know. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> it appreciates their seed scent as much as I. Well, we got him. We got him. So about this final one. Bland a goose. Oh, hi there. We bring you this lovely boundaries, buddy. You know, just here to socialize, have fun, look at some people, uh, give some gifts out. You know, 
Eat some food, be merry, drink. Uh, so there's a lot of activities. Just one person who I usually do all that, all that at parties. I do all that and so much more. I'm just a very active person. I love making big smiles on people's faces. It's my favorite pastime. Yep. It's really kind of you. What gives you usually kind of bunnies like this? Whatever the person's heart desires, coffee, uh, balloons, cake, Adderall, um, uh, you know, water. Well, I kept seeing how there were people getting their hearts broken at these parties, so I'm trying to make smiles happen. It's really sweet of you to try to spit hand this. Have you seen any successful? Plenty of success. I recently helped this man by the name of Edwin get over his breakup. Oh, Edwin. He was brokenhearted? I hadn't realized he was going through tough times. Yeah, well, you see, he was going to break up with his current girlfriend, but he hasn't gotten around to it yet. He's a little too nervous, but he is going to do it soon. He promised me and himself. Oh. <laughs> oh, are you two, um, together? Oh, uh, 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 gulp? Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, yes. I heard earlier that you were planning on to break up with your girlfriend. I just can't be with someone who would do that. It's not me, it's definitely you. Yeah, can't can't be with someone who will break up with your girlfriend, man. Look who's broke up. She's doing plenty of... <laughs> you sure do. You should smack some fucking sense into that bitch. Ha ha. Just kidding. Ha ha. I'm a lawyer. Ha ha. Allegedly. Ha ha. No, God, no, don't, 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 don't do it. Don't. Oh, no. I can't believe you, Edwin, planning to break up with your girlfriend behind my back? Yeah, behind, behind her back, you dog. What, that's ridiculous. Why would you even care, Blonda? Yeah, why would you? Because, Edwin, you're a two-time vampire. Been with you and your drama, we're over. Uh -huh. I'm a meat blind and bit around with your creepy fangirl antics anyways. Oh no. Good riddance, Edwin. I hope you and your dramatic self find happiness in the darkness. Wow. Uh, Whatever, blind. Uh, I'll find someone who appreciates a vampire with a little edge. Wow. Boom! Boom! Wow. 13 out of 13. And my game is frozen. All right. That was the game. <laughs> that was the, that was the game. That was, that was the game. Um, I, I literally cannot. Yeah, it, it, it froze. Well. Let's just clean that up. We're just going to go back to the BRB. Um. All right. Chat, I'm going to be right back. I'm going to take a piss real quick. And then we're going to assess a couple of things. All right, get a piss. One sec.
Okay, okay. Oh, God. Oh. Zero and zero and zero. Boom. Beautiful. Damn. It was a long shit. Oh, wow. Everyone's on. Let's see what's going on. Oh. Oh. What's going on over here? All right. What the fuck is this? Did someone fucking break the screen? Oh, someone threw a rock at the fucking theater. Yo, what the fuck? Where is everyone? Who the hell is everybody? You've got to be in the main, main area. Where can they be? Huh? Mark. Where is it? Howdy. Hey. Hey. How are Yo. you? What's going on? I'm How's doing it? good. What you up to? What are you guys doing? I'm I'm, I'm pissed. Uh oh. You're, you're then... pissed? You're pissed off? Oh. Yeah, someone killed killed my friend. Why? Well, well, sorry about that. We got hey. we got the stuff was, though. This bird. Oh, we why, got it. We got would, the ice. Why would Bird do that yeah. to you? I don't know. I don't know why he would do that. He killed. He killed my best friend. He killed. Hey, Josh. He killed. I. I actually left a note on his house. He killed. Uh, he killed my my duck. Hi, Josh. Oh, he's horrible. Yeah. No, he's my best friend. He also killed all of our villagers. It's horrible. Why would he do that? Hi, Ant I don't know. I have no clue why he would do that. <laughs> I think I think he did it on accident, but I'm kind of bloodthirty. Yeah. Well, what, what are you guys doing? What are, what are you What are you been up to today? Huh? Where I'm, I was helping them out. They they got some ice. We're gonna clean up the Nether Hub. We're gonna make it. Oh yeah, nicer. you get some yeah. ice. Yeah, uh, yeah. Jordan, Jordan, and Ryan got it, and then we're gonna oh, clean yeah. up the Nether Hub, and we're Clean gonna... ice, huh? Yeah. Especially yeah. these <laughs> What's going on over here, guys? Hey! Yeah, what's up? Hey. Why the fuck would you kill my bird? What? You killed Bodie. Who? 
You went out to our village. Jordan, get the fuck out of here! What is he talking about? Jordan! He's under the impression that you murdered one of his, his ducks? Ducks? Duck, bird? Bird, duck? That, well, no, I, don't, I don't know what he's talking about. And the villagers that were at our Mesa Village uh, area as well. You're being accused of that, I guess. I, I, I don't know. know. Oh, wow. I, I just I don't know you fucking... Happening. Jordan. Lork, you're looking good. Yeah. We need an adjudicator or a I judge. I got you guys. Heard. I could, I could be. I could be a judge. Some disturbing I'm, I'm pretty news. fair. He's pretty fair. I'm pretty I mean, fair. I did, unfortunately, it was an unfortunately, I have to eat pizza. Um, no, it's yeah. fine. <laughs> no, it's Jordan's completely fine. Delicious. Jordan, you can't yeah. do that. After I've went, all, I've went from zero to a hundred. You can't leave. <laughs> I, it's okay. I, I could, mean, I could settle this a good old-fashioned way, like a like a normal court him. person would do. You just simply oh. heads or tails. Wait, hold Swagger's on. Swagger's very on. impartial. Hey, heads or tails. Michael, on, what? Man. Okay, so what is the evidence? What What was the initial like claim? You like how? Like you can't leave me. <laughs> I, I, may, I may have to. No, this I'll is I'll replace you. Association wait, wait. Problem. My um, chat's saying that Captain did it. Oh, that's such a cool YouTube channel. Thank that's you. hearsay. Hearsay. <laughs> Your Honor. Objection. <laughs> hearsay. Pizza. I'll, I'll fight that is true. That's true. I mean, uh, this okay. all, it's all hearsay so far. But I, I, I if I did, I'm sorry. Did, did, okay. did you did create a weaponry that had, um, you know, is splash that the damage? This one? Hand, I think, is that the weaponry? That looks like it would It doesn't have splash damage. That really looks like it would kill many things. Did you go to a village and kill a bunch of iron golems and then kill a bunch of villagers? No, hold on. What if he just what if he just killed the golem and then the zombies killed the villagers? Yeah, but there's no there was no. It was a it was a it was a building of zombies then, right? Yeah. Hey everybody! Hey, welcome back to Minecraft. Thanks. It's a pleasure to be back. You guys want to have a good time? I sure do. Over here. This is a captain's We're gonna have a great time. And an ant venom problem too. <laughs> I mean, they, they can talking? come too. I was just trying to get Wait, is it, this is yeah. a, hey. a me problem now? Yeah. So yeah. I was just trying it's to get whole, him. Just the whole <laughs> crowd now. I was just trying to get away from it's him. Fine. It's fine. So <laughs> fucking loud. Yeah, no. If I did that, I'm I'm sorry. So what can I do to, to make kill, it up? You killed my best friend. I literally have a bird emo <laughs> for this yeah, for this creature that you oh, killed. I don't remember seeing a bird at all ever. Duck with the heart of a bald eagle. A small a small duck. It would it would be easy to miss if you weren't looking for him. But but. It, it, he's very important. You might have stepped on him by Heart mistake. Was... That, that's I a really small happened. duck. That's a very small duck. I'm so sorry. I mean, look I'm at the so size sorry. of your feet. You killed all of our villagers. Well, I didn't have these before that. I didn't kill all of you. I think it's probably like a couple hundred, no, hundred diamond no, feet, but unfortunately, sure you're going to have to sort it out. Yeah, he's really a couple hundred, hundred diamonds. diamonds. I'm gonna, I got to eat my pizza. He stepped on that duck. Like Jordan stepped on those rats on his roof. Oh, this is a different group. How's that? Be sure to post oh, a review hello. for Pizza and Captain Sparkles that, too. Is that enough? Hey, you yeah, that, aren't you that I person that comments in all those YouTube rubies. videos? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I am that guy that comments on these That's videos. fucking crazy. All right. You're that little fucking <laughs> apple worm fucker. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry it's, that I'm so Why, why'd you stop? No, I would be too, man. Because I, Donkey played it. Bookworm. I, I, I won. Right, that, that was it. Yeah, that was, that was my goal. That was the, that was it? I mean, the bit was over. I didn't want to, like, run it into the ground. Really? So yeah, you, you, you still don't comment? Head, you you know? don't comment on everything anymore? Nah, not really. Actually, recently, recently, I have a, I have a new gimmick. Um, there's, there's these TikToks, right? No, dude, no, it's funny. It's I'd there, like there are TikToks listen. for Dong huh? Hua Jinlong, the industrial grade glycine supplier. What did you supplier. just say? Dong Hua oh, Jinlong, industrial the, grade glycine. Are you not? Are you talking who, about? Are you talking about the the fucking factory that makes cutlery? Uh, no, no, it's the factory that makes industrial grade glycine. They they meet Wait, literally the, every standard. Not the the unbreakable glass where the guy speaks like perfect English and steps on the glass. No, but I love that guy. Does anyone know what I'm talking about? <laughs> the star is something. I have no cutlery idea what you're factory. About. Does anyone 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 know what I'm talking? It's like a TikTok channel. I except potentially do not know. It's it is literally a TikTok channel of a, of a of a Chinese woman overseeing her her slave laborers saying that they aren't working for Oh, enough. dude, I do know. Where, where they plug in like the USB lights? I I I I, I think. It was, okay. It was the star something I, I, something something. I have seen I have seen people like I, like, I have it like... saved. I was going to buy their cutlery to support them. <laughs> I fucking love those like those like fake labor camp like like TikToks. I love them, and it's just like 
it's just like two women plugging in USB lights, putting them in a pile, and then like when they're finished with their pile, they just go back to the old pile and plug in those USB lights. Damn. And there's just we should do yeah. we should do like a real a real one of those. Yeah, I like, be, it I would like, be a lot more like profitable. That. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. I think you're onto something here. I think so. I think we need uh, you know how we have Christmas trees? Yeah. I think we, we need to have like human lights so that everyone can be their own Christmas tree and you connect your like your um lights into like a portable battery and then everyone can like mix and match and like customize themselves. I'm not Do you know what do you have any idea? So then it's like you could also put like a little star on your head. I, I, you could yeah, put a star on your head. But I but I wouldn't do that. See, I appreciate I, yeah. that. No, yeah. You could have like colorful lights too. You, remember, you have you a, a have sheep colors. on your back who who <laughs> seemingly has What the yeah, fuck? Was, I, was a li I was a little upset about that. I'm sorry. Yo. <laughs> Yo, holy Damn. shit. Yo. Yeah, I, holy listen. fuck. <laughs> you know. <Bro. laughs> Jesus, dude. Come on, man. He could have just. <laughs> listen. Where's my Where's my fish and shit sign? I think Ryan Crinios has that. <laughs> you, did you even see the little Goku hiding in the corner? What in the in the huh? in the fish and shits sign? I think Ryan Crinios has that. Oh my god! All yeah. right, Tortellini's fine. Yeah, Looking at like, everyone oh, else's oh, dramas. Hey, what are you doing there? I just wanted to see you while you were speaking. I wanted to respect. It's oh, like okay. sorry, this you is gotta, kind of my sorry, human Christmas tree idea. Scoot in here, sorry. No, it's okay. It's okay. Good. It's fine. What the fuck was that guy? I don't know. That was like. Really hey, man. Weird. <laughs> hey Swagger. How you doing? Really disrespectful. Hey, nice cane. Uh, I can barely, I can barely, I can barely yeah, hear you over all that bullshit behind me. Bioco What's going limited. on? They're, I mean, they're just yeah, what is going on over there? there? I don't know. So what I've been, I, I literally get them probably four or five. You got a on my spam call they earlier. Have Thirty views a piece. Oh, did you and answer it? Commenting on all. I usually do. I was, so, I was upset. I was on stream. Like I couldn't, I couldn't answer it. Cause usually, if I have nothing to do, I spend at least an hour yeah, I, calling I, I, back I to the scam call center, center, and they usually patch me into about seven hater, or eight yeah. different people. Dude, and I spend oh, as much time oh, as like I can fucking with them, Wait, no, the just fuck? wasting their time and fucking with them. Chat? What it's actually hey, really fun. Like a good. That's the way to do it. Mess with them a little. What the fuck? Oh, Hero Brian's here. Hero Brian is here. Hey, Dang it! Yeah, unfortunately, yeah, they could like dox you if you did it on. You should do, you just I mean, answer it, yeah. free ball it right on stream. I literally saw that. I prefer not. <laughs> I did free ball it on stream. You think you're Brian? <laughs> you, you know, you never okay, know. In, ca in case they actually are, are like not a spam caller and they say me, they no say my you. hello. Is this my full because fucking name? It'd be horrible. <laughs> at this full address. Yeah, at this full I'm address. Yeah, it would not be good. Oh, he wants permission. Yeah, that would be a little sad. But you know, sometimes you gotta take risks. Where's everyone else? So many people were circle I, tunes. Yeah, I was because I was gonna. I don't know. He blew up when we were in the Twilight Forest, and I haven't seen him since. Oh, is everyone just in the Twilight Forest? Oh shit! Wait. Well, we all came back uh, after okay. it was a grand adventure. Wow. We listened to Hatsune Miku. We got some wolves. We watched circle tunes get blown up. Pretty good. Really, the perfect day. Yeah, not bad at all. I'm just gonna go around then and uh, and, and say hello to people. Go find some people. Well, Jan, very, very good. Very good. We're making a round. Let's see how this gazebo's progressed. All right. Is that seriously af before and after lobotomy? Guy on the right looks a lot fucking happier, I tell you. Oh, this looks so cute. Yeah, very nice. Damn. And has uh, Panda gone ahead and done his thing over here? I don't think so. Hmm. I have been to the Twilight Dimension. We were there like the first maybe two days? Three? Oh. Full of water. Dirt tanks. Interesting. Not really much happening. We'll do our rounds. 
We'll do a round. What's this home? What is this? A little boring. Oh, it's Ant Venom Shack. Not a bad shack. All right, a little backyard here. Anyone else cranking their hog? What the fuck? Me? Raise his hand. Where the hell am I? Behind the theater. Ah. No rings. There was nothing over here. It must be on the other side of the island. What the hell? I'm gonna make any YouTube videos in the. Yeah. I have some videos cooking. I also have a Vine channel about to, about to come out. And a couple of things. A couple of things. Oh, wow. Church. Oh, person. I'm a slut for people. Hey. 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 How you doing? I'm good. I'm just making a car. A car? A car. Car. Making a car? I got a car, mate. Um. W um. <laughs> it's good, right? It looks like a fucking lunar lander, man. It's one of those, uh, like, Tokyo cars. Like a one smart, like, like a, a, a smart yeah. car? Yeah, it's one of those smart cars. I feel like I'm losing brain cells just looking at it, man. <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? You gotta, you gotta, you gotta extend this port out way more. You reckon? Yeah, way more, yeah. You need to extend this port way out more? by, like, two blocks so that there's room for, like, an engine in here. Ah. Uh. You know, right now it just looks like a fucking... You know. I see what you mean. Yeah, it's a little too square. It needs <laughs> it needs to elongate a little, I think. You're, You're you close. You reckon you could help me out? Do you have the material? Not really. Uh, no. Oh. It's all on you, man. Shit. It's like the Misfits car. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Callback. Yep, callback. This one might be able to drive a bit better, though. Probably. Who the hell is growling? Wow, beautiful yeah. church. Later. Wow. Beautiful. I love the w I love the way it looks. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. I love this little area, too. There's some projects. Wow. Swagger souls. Uh, it's me, Drake. Drake? That's right. Like, like, champagne poppy? That's exactly right. We're, I've been turned into a duck. You've been turned into a duck. Why do you sound and like I that? Need eight diamonds to to release new music. You need eight diamonds to release new music. That's right. Whoa! No, I don't have any diamonds. Oh Wanna no! Want to see me do a little trick? Sure. Are you going to summon Millie Bobby Brown? Uh, quack, quack, quack. Quick, quick. It's Hero Brian! It's Hero Brian! It's Hero Brian! I have to kill Hero Brian! It's Hero Brian! I have to kill Hero Brian! You're a hero, Swagger Souls! No problem. 
Oh man, I can't believe it. Here you go, Brian. You just kind of, you just kind of ran up. Him. You just kind of ran up. You saved us all. Isn't that Notch's brother we just killed? Oh, well, it, I don't know. We? I mean. the boat, I saw you. Have you by any chance griefed my house again, Berg? No. Wait, you're not. Wait, are you? Hey, what's up? What's up? Mary's nice. is about to kill that guy. Huh? This is fucked up. Mary's is gonna kill that They're guy. Oh, well, you reckon so? Yeah. Hey, man, you got the lighters hanging out and everything. Yep. Damn. It's only like 75 you know, degrees just... out. It's perfect weather for it. Yeah, you I don't know, really got but... many. I have an image of a diamond. There. I don't know if I'm tripping Sack or this duck is Drake. What do you mean? This guy right here. Have you met Drake? Oh shit, it's Drizzy. What's up? Whoa, Hello. whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't get too close. He'll pickpocket you and use the money to gamble on steak. You need a max win. I need a max, max win. win. You might have heard of me from my music. Oh yeah? And your allegations. Sing a, I'll sp sing a song. I'll spit a few bars for you right now. <laughs> Ready? Uh, uh, uh. We're here in Toastin City. It's looking real pretty. Everybody's here except for Mr. Shitty. Who is Mr. Shitty? Well, he's my brother. I don't like him very much. He fell down into a dumpster. Here I go. I'm flying away now. It doesn't look that like flying because I'm in a boat, but well, it is. I'm not buying it. Yeah, I should have, that shit was heat, <laughs> that is, bro. That yeah, is not Drake that is at all. Nothing. That is not Drake at all. Oh, uh, if it was Drake, I would have been fast asleep. Yeah. Maybe feeling a little, uh... What's the word? Hey guys. Uh oh. Oh, what the fuck? Submissive. Hang on. You guys. No, no, stop, stop, stop. <laughs> Hang stop on. It. I just went to Oakland. Was that the real hero, Brian? Oh, shit, Drake's back. Not anymore. Well, I'm just gonna position myself all nicely in my little duck corner. Quack. Quack, quack. Quack, quack, quack. Well, <laughs> well, well, slap me, well, well, that was great. What the fuck are we doing now? Oh, these goddamn hedges, man. My alarm has been going off in my bedroom every like 10 fucking minutes because I woke up before the alarm. You guys probably can't hear it though. What else is going on? Where the fuck is everybody? I'm trying to mingle. I'm trying to mingle a little. What the hell? Where are you? He's too far. <laughs> He's too far away. I'm just trying to figure out where the peeps are. Oh, Mills fear me. Thank you for giving the tier the, the tier ones. All ten. All right. What else is good? The rub club. I love that. You all right? Oh, thanks, Mills, for your mate. Who did? Oh, here we go. How you doing? Hey, what's up? Uh, much. Just looking at these beautiful builds. Cool. Look at Emma's uh, house. Look. It's beautiful. Isn't it? I hey. like it. Can I hey, have what's a, up? You mind if I have a tour? Sure. Oh, yeah. You gotta see the basement? I finished the basement. I'd love to see the basement. Let's go. This is my oh, wow. surprise just gotta, secret. Just gotta admire your, your beautiful home here. It smells very nice. Thank you, thank you. This is the best part. It smells a little musty. Yeah. It's um it's my sex dungeon. 
There's the circumcision machine over there. In Whoa. Case you need to take an extra centimeter off. I didn't know you were a doctor. Uh, here's, the, here's the cuck chair. Uh, yeah. Um, the chain mail, the sex swing. Oh, shit. Know. The chain mail is right up my alley. There you go. Look, it fits you perfectly. It, I bet it does. Look at that. I Looking think it's pretty good. good. It's pretty good. It's kind of yanking on my chest here. A yeah, little. Not, you know. Yeah, but, you know, that's to the thrill. It's very cold. That's and adds heavy. To the BDSM feel. It feels like I'm wearing a weighted blanket. Except it's not warm. It's actually just pretty painful, honestly. I have a legit gambeson. I've literally worn one before. But I think it would actually be hard to, like, do anything in this. Did you just gulp? Is it? <laughs> I didn't know what to say. Did you just gulp? I, d I made a noise. Right. Okay. Well, I will interpret yeah. that not as a gulp. Uh-huh. You know, I'll put that back for you. So it's a little sweaty. I'm right. getting a little Sorry. clammy in this. We never, we never clean them up. So you know, I think adding the stench to it. That's, everybody's that's bodily. why, it, that's why it ripped out most of my hair. There you go. We can We're gonna. Yeah. I'm gonna collect it and save for later in a jar. Oh yeah. I'm gonna scrape it off. Yeah. For, cut it know, up with other, a. My other practices. Cut it up with a with a, with a Chase bank card. <laughs> Yeah, you know. Yeah. Put it in a spell. So, what is a secret project no peeking thing? Oh, uh, well, it was in case anybody, because this was just the, you know, oh, stone. Oh, there's, there's nothing uh, behind, there's thing. nothing behind there, is it? No, it was just the people came down here and saw me working on it, because, you know, I didn't want everybody to know I have a sex dungeon. I don't know yeah, if the HOA you, you would approve. Yeah, no, you would hate, you would hate anybody to know you have a sex, oh, well, you get the candles and everything. Wow, yeah. Fucking... No, it's, it's invite only, you know, so you're one of the few people that have gotten to come down here. Wow. That I trusted with my secret. Well, I feel, I feel honored. I can only yeah. assume what those are for. Oh, only, yeah, we have a whole room dedicated like, to it as well. For, like, writing letters and wax seals. Yeah, you love stand, letters you to your lost yes. ones, yeah. Yep. Past orgasm partners, whatever you need. That's crazy. Do you have a lost and found for all the virginities that you'll steal here? Should get a little lost and found bin. I should incorporate it. I do have a bunch of pictures of Nopify in the cuck chair that I have to put up. Is there room for more? Herobrine. It's me, Herobrine. Sounds... More submissive you know, and breedable than I originally anticipated. <laughs> Not for real. Could I be of use? That no, made Ryan me. That made that made me shudder. <laughs> I see why yes. everybody was so afraid of you. They they just weren't ready. I'm just trying to be nice, and people keep killing me. What's that? You're always welcome down here. You want to sit in the cup chair? Spend some time. Yeah. Beautiful. That's crazy. <laughs> That's wild. It's fun. Is it? So what yeah. does he what does he do? He just sits in there and Yeah, it's the cuck chair, you know, you just sit and you watch everybody partake. Whoa! Oh god, I circumcised myself. No, My you bad. just you just made the wound deeper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's fine. It'll it'll heal eventually. Well, he's just, he's just staring intently, waiting for us to do something, he's isn't he? He's ready to go. Yeah. I feel pressure. I have to watch. Hey, look, Emma, I appreciate you letting me down here, but, uh, uh I, yeah, I, it, I, I, I need to, I need to be taken out to dinner first. I have like a whole, there's like a whole thing. I don't uh, blame you. When your time yeah. is right, your time is right. I'm a little, know? I'm I a little, I'm think... a little hard to get. I'm a little hard to get. I understand. But hey. But, hey, when it's time, I will wine and dine you, and we will have and a great time. Of course, you're more than, more than welcome. Come to my haberdashery when, whenever you whenever you feel hungry. Absolutely. I, you know, I'll Can start... Can I come to the haberdashery? No. no, you gotta stay in the cup chair. You're not allowed. But yeah, no. I got a whole variety of food, and soon I'll start stocking Italian sausage. I'll bet. What a freak. What a freak. Hey. 
Yo, man, Emma's a freak. Oh, really? What? I don't. I don't. What? Emma's a freak at four and four. Did something happen down there? No. Your eyes look different. You've lost that innocence that I know you once had. Okay, where's everyone else? Damn. Fucking e-girls, man. E-girls with their strange... Wow. Just, just running out of words. Literally, literally, literally have, have no idea what, what to even add. Oh, I did come out with my chest plate on. Uh-oh. My bad. Gotta g gave it away. Gave away what was happening. Damn. What else is good? Is there anyone else around? Or is it just kind of a... A slow one? Tucker should be around you somewhere. Boomy's around. Oh, Jiminy. Wow. It's one of those. Tucker's building a railway. I hear that there's a lot of shit going on in the nether. I'm not really familiar. I've really been to the nether in part to get some quartz. <laughs> Damn. What's going on over here, huh? Anything cool? Anything new? They're making nether highways. Uh, uh, Excuse me. What is my favorite black? All right. Grand opening. The boss, California. Oh, yeah. Why is everything so cheap? Oh, no. I need to lower my prices, man. All this fucking... It's horrible. Oh, t -shirts. Gulp. Bird took everyone to the twilight earlier. <laughs> Is that where they all are? Must be where they all are. We'll jump in the twilight real quick. Who's that? Oh, it's Lark. Lark, where is everyone? Uh, Ant Venom's over there with Michael. That's about all I know. That's all you know? Wow, man, what is he's fucking disappeared? Everybody's vanished. Yeah. I went to, uh, you know, get to see a, a nice basement. I think there's, I think there's been some, like, development on an island over kind of by spawn. Maybe that's where people are. Oh, yeah. You know, be the one yeah, over there on like the right? Yeah, Yahi and Poke are. this way not that that's the that's the sister the, the property sisters made that for connor eats pants uh-huh oh why is keep he... up with the lore swagger <laughs> look man i'm out of the loop this is why i'm trying to find people yeah i think uh whoa what the fuck this yeah. is a whole new area there's a whole new world to explore what Yo, what the fuck? Hey, Tucker. How are you, man? You, you working on the bridge? Like a troll under the bridge. Yeah, what's cool. up? It looks good. It looks very good. Yeah, it's gonna do some uh, stairs underneath in the middle. Oh, yeah. Arch is, is this where everyone, everyone's at? Where is everybody? I don't know. It, it's kind of quiet around. It's a real but ghost town. people on. There was a bunch of people on. I was like, wow. Maybe I won't end my stream. Maybe I'll go have conversations with the beautiful people of SDMP, but they're all, they're all, they're all fucking doing stuff. I know. I know. It's been quiet. I did. There was a group that went to the Twilight Zone. Uh huh. Uh, but since then, it's been quiet. Right. Hmm. I'll look around a bit more. This is getting late. You see, you see Ted's new spot? Uh, the one right near my house? Yeah, beautiful. Yeah, came out really nice. Really, really nice. Really enjoy. Beautiful having that. He's gonna bring people into my into my area. 
Yeah, and they is this, buying is this where you live in? Dabbery. Damn, man. Holy shit. Man, they were, uh, they were doing shit today. What is this? Oh. It's a fucking cactus machine. Huh. Oh. Oh, me and mine. What the hell is this thing? Oh. Cool. Hey, Swagger, what would your meat canyon be? What are you talking about? What do you mean? What do you mean my meat canyon? What do you mean? What do you mean by this? All right. Let's go there's another, another a bridge to another land. Fuck. Oh, what would my freaky parody look like? How am I glad I got these uh, chicken feet on? Yes, I see. Um... Dude, probably, it would probably, I don't know, maybe like, uh, I'd like to imagine he would like do a, like a face reveal parody where like I take the helmet off, but like my whole head is like the shape of my helmet. So it's like you're, uh, like, like, like how you open a can of dog food and like the fucking, the whole thing, the shape of the can slides out. Like my whole head is like the inside of the helmet, like shaped like the inside of the helmet is all like crushed and bloated and fucked up. Yeah, like a canned chicken. Yeah. And my character has, yeah, he's like, yeah, my body would be like the size of my head or whatever. It's what I would imagine, some grotesque thing of this sort. But goddamn, we're running around in circles, you know what around? It may just be one of those days, Chan, one of those slow days. Maybe, uh, maybe we, we, we have to... Oh, uh, pretty. Maybe we must reconvene another day. It's kind of how I'm feeling. I'm getting a little tired, getting a little, uh, getting a little overwhelmed. We did do a lot. We did literally stream, uh, a different game for three hours and then came back. Looks like people are off adventuring and building and doing shit. How many balls I got? Two. Why am I breathing so loud? I'm not! Am I? Am I being fucked with? Lovely weather today. Hello? <laughs> <laughs> there's three people over here. Hold on, there's there's people getting into mischief in this in the in the uh the basement oh. of questionable activities. Oh, the, everybody's down here. What the hell? Kawabunga! Hey guys. I don't know if Beef picked up the rest hey, of Hey, Emma. It. You know. Hey, what's up? I'm starting to feel a little less special. Well, you said you were. You said you were. I know what I get. said, you but were, I didn't you mean it. To be into it. I didn't mean it. Okay? Oh. I thought you would, you would read my mind. You didn't think I'd move on that quickly? I mean, look, you got a, you got a full basement now. I mean, two don't people worry, did just get you. brutally murdered I in here. I pay you. Well, it was consent. That's just so unfortunate. That's just really yeah. unfortunate. That, that we locked so in here. Fucked. I just accidentally destroyed all their stuff. <laughs> I destroyed the sex dungeon. Yeah, oh, the hell sex yeah. Dungeon, the circumcision machine is gone. Oh, the cantalabra is gone. I can fix it. Let me fix it. Let me fix it. Give, give me a shot at redemption. Let me fix it. Now. Guys, guys, Minecraft items are temporary, okay? I mean, I'm But chilling. our friendship is forever. That's so real, Lark. The sex dungeon Who's will always prevail. Who the fuck is Mr. Oh, Blue? It's Mr. Blue! Oh my god! Holy shit! What the fuck? 
Hello, everyone. It's me, Mr. Blue. How does everybody Holy know shit. about my sex dungeon? It's Mr. Blue. How the fuck is Mr. Blue? Oh my god, it's Mr. Blue. I am. Hello, everyone. It's me, Mr. Blue. Yeah, no, I, we, heard, we fucking heard Blue. you the first time, Mr. Blue. Well, anyway, what is going on with you, guy? You mean guys? What the fuck is this? You, you said guy singular, and I think you meant to say it plural. Well, you guy, my name is Mr. Blue, and well, it is really nice to meeting you all, so. Hello, yeah. Mr. Blue. Mr. Blue, I don't, I don't want to be the one to, to be uh, telling you this, but you got a little bit of um, the mustard on your shirt. Well, that is because I'm eating a hot dog earlier. <laughs> well, it was delicious as well. Thank you. Well, uh, <laughs> looks like it was probably pretty good if I left some stuff like that. <laughs> <laughs> I am Mr. Blue, yeah. Well, I like that. I like that about you, Mr. Blue. Out of this place. Mr. Blue, I'm, I'm sorry to tell you, Mr. Blue, but you're stuck in here with the rest of us. Yeah, Mr. You Blue, I, I am in order to help you, Mr. Blue, if, if that is what sort of the things you want. Well, I am looking for a whole sort of bunch of things in my life. A whole sort of well, helping, huh? Yeah, well, I am Mr. Relax, Blue. I, and, I speak. <laughs> I speak blue knees. I am just walking around and being a little blue guy. I, 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 can, I can see you, Mr. Blue, walking around being a little blue guy. I like that about you, Mr. Blue. How you, how you, not only Mr. But Blue as well. Yes, I am. Well, I am Mr. Blue. You are thank Mr. You Blue. Thank you very much. Of, I, you're very welcome, Mr. Blue. I thank you. I thank you very much. No, I thank you more. You as well. You have a cook card. Well, Vitamin I am D. Thanking you as well. Mr. Blue, okay. can you preach about the health benefits of of liquid colloidal silver? Well, I am a really big fan of liquid colloidal silver. Well, because when I am drinking it, you can becoming a really blue guy like me. Well, I am not going to be saying right now that I am blue because I'm drinking the silver, but I was born this way. Well, if you want to be a blue guy, well, I guess that is one way to becoming blue. What is the next question? How long have you been blue? I have been blue since as far as I can remember in the time. Uh, I think maybe back in the 90 or maybe the 80 as well when I'm born. Well, I used to have a show called the Mr. Blue Show, and that was a really fun time. I, I remember you from the Mr. Blue Show. You were you had the blue house and uh, the blue Corvette and uh, the blue girlfriend. Yes, yeah, sadly my blue girlfriend has died from has died by, from blue disease. Well, oh. she's my ex-wife now. She is dead. Mm, yes, died from blue disease. Really sad. And yep. I remember also from the show, it was the Mr. Blue and Mr. Orange show, but I am I am not really on great terms with Mr. With, Orange with Mr. now Orange. No, Mr. Orange, yeah, after that horrible racist tirade he did on the news, well, I, I'm not a fan of Mr. Upset. Orange either. Yeah, well, that is a pretty nasty guy, and also yeah. I'm Mr. Blue, and he was Mr. Orange. Yeah, you're Mr. Blue, which, which I know and I appreciate. Don't anything against blue people. What do you mean, well, blue people? Knowing. Yeah. I, I mean... What like, do you mean, blue people? Like, people that are blue. And I don't have anything against them. Okay, dude. Okay, dude. It's fucking 2024. Going yeah. the route of Mr. Orange, I see. Pretty, pretty fucking, pretty despicable, if you ask me. No! Don't kill me! Pretty fucking despicable. Don't kill me, please! No! I'm sorry well, about I'm sorry about him, Mr. Blues. He doesn't have a, a, a blue clue. Oh well, that is okay. At the end of the day, I am a guy that is all about, well, yep, being, being accepting and understand that maybe a prejudice is based in an internalized fear. So, yes. I'm really maybe not he had a bad, maybe maybe he had a bad interaction with blue people when he was younger. That is perhaps the case. Well, but I that's hope still that, my it, show. Yeah, yeah, cuz I think you would do a great job at, at, at taking away some of that prejudice. That horrible yeah. prejudice. You, you can make friends with this guy. He's blue. Yeah, you know oh this fellow blue guy. Hello, Hello, Mr. Blue. I'm Mr. Oh, Blue. Fucker, nice to meet you. My dungeon. Um, yeah, it's I'm just here for my shit. Did any of you pick up my I'm stuff? I'm Mr. Blue. Uh, you're not Mr. I'm guys. Mr. Blue. Well, I suppose in a world that there is a world that we can both be a Mr. Blue, if you would like. I don't really mind that we're both Mr. Blue. It is good that, to see other blue people around as well. I really like this. You know, I wasn't expecting you to be so nice about it. Now I feel bad for coming on aggressively. No, that is okay. I understand very much the It actually makes tone. me feel better knowing that there's someone like me in the world. I never had this feeling before. I have nothing yeah, the, I've, I've only ever met I've only ever met a, a man with the skin hue as 
Puce. I've only met, met a man with the, the skin color of Puce before, but never blue. Never blue, only Puce. Yeah, I just I just didn't know this was a possibility. Yeah, but well, too, you seem too, very, too you pretty. Seem very nice, sir. Two pretty close, closely looking guys over here. He's a little light skin. We could, we could. No, I know. Right. No, it, it's a spectrum. Oh yeah, I'm on. I'm on one of those. <laughs> yeah. Hey, yo, What's save. so funny? Nothing. Well, I'm glad that we can all getting along right now. This is a fantastic <laughs> time, and in a dungeon, perhaps that we are in. Yes. Yeah, this is my second yeah, dungeon. Is, I'm what glad is we're this? all bonding oh. in here. Bondage, I like bondage, bondage. Swing that I can have it was invite swinging. only, but some people have just invited themselves in. Well, I just want to be part of the Careful, fun, Mr. Know? Blue. Yeah, you know, I get it. Our you may have, you may have, you may have just stained your moment. shirt. Um, swing, getting on that swing. swing. Well as well. Sneaky, I think, as well. Play, I, I think I'm going to get off the swing as well. Why is, uh, why is here Brian down here? Oh, he's, the, he's our cuck. He's our resident cuck. Ah, okay. Okay, well, that's cool. He just hangs out. I'm glad we have a server cuck to to work with man yeah, oh and there you know, and every server like... <laughs> needs one Ooh. yeah she's gonna have her way with them guys well maybe i should i have nothing against blue people oh yeah he's also racist against blue people okay. can i come out <laughs> well should I, should I let them out well I, I, i'm, I'm kind of scared to let them out <coughs> I'm hard. <coughs> wow, it is stuffy in here. That's the VIP. We are in a sex dungeon. It is stuffy so. in here. <coughs> I'm hard. <coughs> Whoa! Oh my God. I might get the blue disease and, and being well, I might I might die like my wife died from blue disease. Wait, you died your oh, wife? Oh yeah, no, That's they so they taught us about blue disease. I know all about hey, that. Did your wife get the blues? <laughs> hey, that is very <laughs> offensive to our people. Sorry, well, you're not Mr. like Blue. that. Well, that is okay. You know, I can under, I can appreciate a, a trying to making a joke about it as well. So everything is all good and okay in the world. But Mr. Blue, your wife is dead. Well, yes, that is true as well. But I am living with my my wife is and she is my in my heart all the time now. So I love that. I love being alive. My little blue heart. Your, your little blue heart. You know, maybe a bit bigger now that your wife is sharing it. Perhaps. That was beautiful. Maybe that is why my artery are clogging with all my... With all... I'm having a health problem, but that is neither here nor it is there. So, yeah. Well, I would assume there would be such a problem to your health. Usually blue skin is a, you know, symptom of Ow. oxygen deprivation. Are you able to take uh, full breaths, Mr. Blue? Let me giving it a shot. <gasps> Ooh. <gasps> Ooh. Yeah, hold on. That sounds good. Oh. Mm. That's Ooh. Good. That is a big, healthy, big Ooh. breath from me, that, Mr. That, Blue. That was pretty, you know. I don't know if that was. As far, not, as, far as, as Blue people's lungs go, it's pretty decent. Well, I mean, mine, mine are pretty good. Yeah, but you no, have one I'm eye. I'm hearing a little breath from you. Well, yeah, let me hear it. You have one eye. You want. Do you want to hear my breath? You have one eye and yeah, two lungs. He has two <gasps> eyes and one lung. That's my breath. <gasps> that is sounding a really healthy breath. See, I told you. Yeah. How long? How long can you can you hold a note for? All right, give me a note. Not so very long, yeah. Pretty, pretty good. Not bad. Yeah, yeah. You guys, have you all tried to harmonize before? I feel like Plenty that would times. be a good bonding experience. You want to start a choir? Not really. I just like to hold my breath. It's really good when uh, girls no, sit on no, your face. Cool. I'm getting out of here. Bye. 
You saying a joke? Fine, at All right. Very cool. Very cool. Wow. What was that whole bit? Fuck what I know, man. I've got no idea. They were weed train? Wow, we're right into it, huh? Blue train. Man, I love that. What a beautiful, what a beautiful little home. What a beautiful little home. What the fuck? What the fuck is this? What the fuck? What the fuck is this, dude? Man, it's unbelievable. Who made this? Who fucking made this shit? It's unbelievable. I love the fucking doors. I love the doors. It's fucking amazing. Oh my god. That, I'm actually nauseous. Oh my god. Fucking hell. Alright, get, get the fuck out of here. Oh wow. How, how, how great. Oh, he's sucker. Hey, man. Hello. Hey, I got something for you. Oh, yeah. You ready? Uh-huh. Okay, here it comes. Mm. There you go. I love it, anticipation. Oh! Oh! There you go. Thank you very much. 309 of those suckers. Yep. Anything you want to say to them? Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you tomorrow night. Anything else? No, I'll leave the rest to you. No, you don't. They're all you yours. Want to, you don't want to say that you love you them? them? Oh, they know I love them. Do they? You kind of feel like you have to say it. Kind okay, of have to I, say it. I, I love you, but I know love at You love what? Huh? You love your little... Tucklers. No. Close. It's like a cat, but smaller. Kittens? Oh, yeah. You know, see the whole thing. I love my little kittens. Yeah, yeah. You bet you do. But you sure do. And yeah, they're all purring. They're yeah. all purring in the chain now. They're all purring. Oh, they're purring, they're purring. sick. They're going... <laughs> <laughs> Strangest purring I've ever fucking heard in my life. But damn, they're loud. You're grossing me out. They're grossing you out. You're fucking shooting the messenger. I guess I am. You are. Here, I'll get another thing for you. Oh, yeah? This is a uh, image of a, a photo that was taken today. I hate like, it. Before I executed I hate this it. goblin. Oh, thank God. Now I love it. You can take that yeah, back. He didn't make it. Yeah. He burned. I love that. I love that. I love that about yeah. So what are you going to build tonight? Are you going to build anything? I don't know, man. I'm just kind of hanging out, looking around. I had a long stream so far. It's been nearly six hours. I, I don't know. I don't know how much further to, to go. I played a little oh, AI shit, game, hours. which was pretty fun. But I was only on. I was on here for about three hours. Yeah, I was on here for. I was coming up on four, mm. but it's past midnight, so I, was I know it's bounce. fucking three p.m. here. I should probably, I should probably like ramp oh, it up. Damn. Yeah, three p.m. You 3 got it good. I'm in Melbourne. Melbourne. Oh, I have to. Huh? I have to wake up early though. I gotta wake up at like eight or nine in the morning to to, to play on the server. That's kind of nice though. That's like a normal job. Kind of, you know. It hasn't been so bad now that I've been taking my magnesium, my gamer steps magnesium. Oh, my wife's taking magnesium. Yeah, is she on Trimag or is she doing just good magnesium? I think it's just regular magnesium. Maybe Aldi brand. You should try. You should try some some AFK man. You get some gamer steps up in you. Hit me up. Send yeah, me a link. I, th I think I will. I think I might. They might just 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 uh, sort you out, man. Yes, yeah, a little bit of gamer, out, bit of gamer so sense AFK. You have, a, little, have a scoop every night. Or go right to bed. A you scoop can, before bed. A scoop before that bed. That does sound nice. You go right to gamersubs.gg. You can use code Swagger if you want. Get a little dis little discount. I think if I didn't use code Schlatt, I'd uh -huh. probably get fired. Well. You could use code swagger once. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll, I'll get one in there. All right, thanks. Just for the AFK. The rest you could do code Schlan. I don't give a shit. 
All right. Well, yeah, thank, you. Thank, the the thank you. Thank you for the raid. Thank you for the raid. You're having sushi. Ooh, thank you. And, and you know what? A, a ruby for you, too. A ruby for a me? Ruby as well. sapphires? No sapphires, just rubies. We'll wait, 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 are. wait. Oh, never mind. I thought I was going to sneeze. All right. Bye. Good night. Damn. The Tucker is gone. He just dropped, dropped it on, on us. Dropped it on us. Dropped you all on us. Well, shit, Chan. You know what I mean? Not really sure what to do What's here. That? Hello? That is a crazy time. Whoa, holy shit. Whoa. Look at this guy. I am seeing a flight in the air now. That is really freaking you, awesome. You did see a flight or, or one or, or, or some in the, in the air right there. How are you, Mr. Blue? Wow. Well, I'm doing quite fantastic as well, if you don't mind my saying thank Not you. Not at all. Well, I just got out of a sex dungeon, and well, mm. huh, let's just say it was a fun, ex a really fun experience. Oh, yes. How are you doing? I'm doing good. Catching my breath. Catching my breath. Well, that is just a fantastic news to be hearing right now. Hmm. Indeed. What would what, what, what have you on this day, Mr. Blue? Well, I am just walking around and enjoying the view and taking in all of the sight. Love and it. I'm thinking to myself, will I ever see all of the beauty in the world? Because, well, there's a lot of stuff, and my time on the Earth is limited. Well, am I ever going to be able to see all of it and explore all of it and talk to all of the people in the community? Is that not the rub? Unfortunately, I am thinking that I am not going to see all of that. So, no. well, I guess I am just taking in as much as I possibly can. World, yeah. world is about cherishing what's seen. Not always about seeing all, but seeing all there is to see. Well, this is making a lot of sense, yeah. Well, I guess if the Lord is curating maybe maybe the things that I am seeing as I am walking the plane of existence, well, maybe that is just all enough that I need. Well, you know what? You know what are, one of the greatest philosophers of our time once said? God's plan. That is the philosopher, if I remember correctly, Drake. Drake, well, Drizzy, Drizzy. Smart guy. I Drizzy, like that Drizzy, guy a lot. Drizzy, 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 yeah, and he is also needing a one dance. He is needing a one dance. Um. Yeah. Well, it was good to seeing you again, Mr. Soul. All, all good. <laughs> all good with you as well, Mr. Blues. Well, I'm gonna be walking around now, maybe taking a look and taking in the sight. Maybe I'm gonna talking to some people and make yes. some friends as well. Yes, you do. You do as you need. Enjoy day, Mr. Blue. Okay, well, hopefully you are enjoying your day as well. Yes. Oh, wait, can you tell me something really quick? Of course, Mr. Blue. I'm looking for a guy named name of Luca Big Pants. Mm. I cannot find him. I'm afraid I can't help you here. Oh, well, that is too bad. Well, if you see him, please let me know. Will do, Mr. Blue. Thank you very much. I need him because, well, I got banned on Twitch and YouTube and all kick and all the platform, and I'm str I need a streaming from his account, so. I understand. Anyway, it is a long story. Yeah, no, I, ho I hope you I hope you, you resolve such things. And I love the way well, you have your pants you covered. What is that that you were saying about my pant? I did not get it. Oh, you said I love the way your pants are cuffed. Oh, thank you. It is a new trend, 2023, 2022 maybe trend, uh, that I am wearing my pants like this. Well, it's brand new. I love it. Well, thank you very much. Well, I appreciate that. Yeah, yeah, I do too. Well, having a good day, Mr. Soul. I'm going to yes. walk around and take in the sights. Yes, you are. Good boy. Good boy. Okay. All right. Man. Hey. Oh, hey. What's up, man? Why are you not, so not shiny? Much. I don't know. I, I, I think iron, iron armor looks super shiny. You are literally reason. like, like, I'm just blowing, right? you're blinding me. Nah, uh, well, you know. I don't know if I'm, I'm looking just... at crinious or, or I'm welding right now. No, listen, I just, this is how I come, man. I'm just, uh, I'm ethereal, you know? It's, it's, like it's, it's, God it's, it's pronounced, it's pronounced ethereal. Ethereal? Ethereal. Ethereal. I didn't know that. I guess I've only read it. It's German, yeah. 
Yeah, I was trying to I was trying to get sharpness on my sword and I've done I think 10 enchants now and not gotten anything good. You haven't gotten a single good enchant on a diamond sword? Well, I wanted like sharpness four, you know, but I keep getting Bane of Arthropods, Spike what about, four. What, what about getting know? two sharpness threes and making a sharpness four? Well, I just got a sharpness three sword or something and maybe I have a sharpness three book what? in my no, house. What? No, you didn't. How, how do you know? It just sounded like you were lying. My sword? Yeah. Do you want, do you want to see? Do you want to see? I don't believe you. Oh, yeah. All right, guys. I think we're going to go ahead and end the stream. It was, uh, it was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed it. Um, all right. We'll, get, we'll give it back. We'll, we'll give it back. Hey. Oh, hey. Sorry. No, you're, you're, did your game crash? No, I just left. Oh. Well, uh, can I, can I get that back? Sure. Oh, it slipped out of my hand. Fuck. Shit, fuck. God, fuck. No, hold on. Nice. Oh, oh, I got it. Now, could you do that in real life? <sighs> Marisa, oh, this Crinios guy is, is threatening to grief your establishment. New AK, oh. what do you think? Oh, whoa. Oh, wow, I like that. Oh, four like, Dragonlore stickers. I like that a lot. How much are the stickers each? Like 50, I think. Or Wait, let me see that. I Look at my bag. This is yours? You have an Arabesque? Yeah. yeah. Damn, yeah. nice. I got one, one, I got one, one with a burger on it. Oh, nice. Oh, that looks nice. I was going to yes. do one of, the, one of the crafts where you put a slur on the gun. Oh, yeah. I was thinking about that, too. But I also remember I have a YouTube channel. <laughs> I probably I probably shouldn't do that. Yeah. CSGO YouTubers this have done cool. worse. It's true. There's one. Nope. I don't want it anymore. There's many. Yeah, there's a couple. That's nice. Wow. Yeah. Right. yeah. Just one there my, you go. My craft. There yeah. you go. Well. <laughs> well. <laughs> hey, I'll was that a fart or something? What's going on over here, huh? Is it Obafi? Obafi is chilling. Is it still just a bunch of gabbity going? There's not, nothing really happening. Ooh. Oh, yeah, there's some shit going on. Oh. Ha ha! What the hell is going on over here? Hey! Yo! How are you? What's up? Yeah, not too much. You saying hello? Yeah, I said hello. Hello. Oh, no, I, I'm just saying hello. Oh, nice. Yeah? Yeah, sorry. I, I, I wasn't allowed to keep my stuff up on land, so I, I had to build this hole. What? Wh why? Well, there's a... There's a lot of stuff going on with the zoning laws around here, so... Right, uh, so you have to resort to living like a troglodyte in a cave? Yep, yep, well, that's, exactly That's that. no good. Yeah, I'm I'm hoping to move out somewhere else eventually, but, but yeah. this is what we got for now. Well, enjoy enjoy your little your little, your little, your little cave there. Have thank a, you so much, a, I appreciate have it. Have a little bit of sushi for your trouble. Oh, thank you. You're no problem. Have a good one. You too. Wow. Well, Chad, I don't know what, what more I could possibly add here. <laughs> Mr. Blue, we're doing the thing. Lark's over there. I think I think we may have to just end the stream, Chad. I think we're we're we're, we're, we're kind of over it. It's three thirty. I haven't eaten since breakfast. It's you know we've been streaming for about just about six hours. I like Mr. Blue as well. Great character, great man of great character. But I reckon we're done here, Chandler. I think we're, we're we're all good. We're just about just about ready to end. Cause damn, it it has been a minute. It has been a minute. Uh, let's just get up here.
real quick. Bump, bump, bump. Bump. All right. Uno momento. Oop, hold on. Look, it's my cat. Oh, shit. This shit has just been playing. All right. All right. All right. Surprisingly still. Sure is. All right, champ. That is it for me today. That is it for me. Um, I will be streaming again on Friday. All right, so that is my Saturday, U.S. Friday. So uh, stay tuned. Stay tuned. All right. Chat. It is time to end the stream. But who, who to raid? Who to raid? Huh. Who to raid? Who to raid? Is Mika Shrimp gonna raid and Venom? Mika Sakis? Yeah, let's raid Mika. It, uh, Mika Sakis, right? M I K A S A C U S? Is that the. Is that the Twitch channel? Yeah? Alright. Raiding uh, Mika. Chad, thank you very much. Let's go for. Yep. Beautiful. Chad, thank you for tuning in. I think we had a we had a really fun stream. Some fun, uh, fun AI kind of kind of memes. I uh, thoroughly enjoyable. That'll probably end up being a video too, which is pretty uh, pretty cool. All right, Chad. I will see you in two days. Enjoy your evening, enjoy your night, enjoy your morning, whatever fucking time it is. Have a good one, and you know, stay safe. Uh, test your drugs. Um, better yet, don't do them. Bye.